out of here. All righty, welcome on back, everybody. So we are now on MMO Misadventures, episode 21. We are cracking away at this. Yes, Mr. Terp, it is true. Not only is it true, but it's true, true, bro. It's the super truth. What up, Mr. Cam? How we doing, brother? When are you going to get back on the streams, dude? Haven't seen you for only 45 minutes late this time? I know, that's pretty good for me, bro. That's pretty good for me. The, on the weekend, I was able not to be late because my kids weren't here. It's a lot easier to be on time when you don't have kids. That's kind of my generic excuse for life in general, is blame everything on my kids. Too much family, too little time, bro. Preach it, my man. Big preach, dude. Shot callers? That's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. We're just starting off on my little crafter lady real quick. Get the researching out of the way. And then we'll be on to the actual fun stuff. Yeah, shot colors could work, bro. Maybe I'll have to run that by the wife. I'll run that one by the wife, see what she thinks. Yeah, man, too, too much family, too little time, bro. That's the way it goes, dude. That's the real struggle. It's worth it, though. It's worth it. Refer to chapter one and two. Good point, bro. Good point. Although, I think that only applies to video games. I'm not sure if that, like, transfers directly to child rearing. I might have to consult a different textbook than uh, the Terp textbook on that one. I'll give you credit where credit's due, but uh, <laughs> that seems like a good way to lose my kids, bro. Seems like a good way to lose the same book. I don't know, man. That's a dangerous book to be applying to families. You might be right, though. Maybe I should just refer back to chapter one, bro. Maybe I just need to stick to chapter one. I right, won't we'll increase the armor value on this. This is like the least fun. I'm not even going to mess with all the other stuff. That's good. Let's get into the gameplay. Switch back over to my beefy boy. My beefy boy Magoo. My hair is all messed up. I didn't even do my hair, bro. I shaved my balls. I shaved my balls before the stream, but I forgot to do my hair. Well, you know, you can't win them all. That's all your life needs. I just need chapter one, bro. Chapter one and chapter two. Chapter one and chapter two. Hey, I got some uh, riding speed lessons. That's pretty cool. I'll, f I'll mess with that. I'll mess with that, dude. Let's see if my sound is right. Let's crank this up one more. Now you got me all nervous about my sound being too low all the time. I feel like my sound is too low when I'm streaming, but then when I go back to edit, all of a sudden everything else is too loud. Okay, so we are gonna be exploring Somerset today. Hence the title of today's stream, Somerset Secrets. You guys ready for some secrets? I know all the secrets and the fact that I don't know anything about the game. So every single thing that I do in Somerset is going to be a secret for me. It's going to be new. It's going to be exciting. Travel to Ralanthini. I don't even remember what this quest is. Pearl of a great price. It's got to be a secret pearl. Somerset, what a beautiful isle, dude, right? It is pretty. It is absolutely pretty. Okay, I'm going the wrong direction because I'm good at this game. I'm top dog at this game, so I was going to, let's start by killing something. I haven't killed something for a while. This thing's actually pretty tough. This is actually pretty tough. I'll probably have to open up my guide again, too. Oh, we got multiples. We got multiple bogeys. I don't remember, uh, I know I'm going for like a Venom build. I'm going to have to look into that. There we go. We, we took care of him still. We took care of these punks. Audio sounds muffled. Like the game audio or my voice audio? Which audio? I didn't change anything about my mic. So. Could just be that I'm tired, but I don't know. The game, your voice sounds good? Okay. I have it coming through Wavelink. It sounds like just low. Turn everything up a little bit. Turn, well, turn the sound effects up a little bit. Sometimes I just feel like the sound effects are way too loud. Sounds weird. 
Let me check something. I think I know why. I think I had two devices capturing it. Does that sound better? Oh, oh I killed that person's sheep. I'm sorry. Better? Okay. Yeah, it's because I, uh, sometimes Steam Link will actually capture my damn game audio, and then other times it doesn't. It depends on the game, so I also had an application, an audio application capture. That's stupid. You know how things be. Ah, this one has been looking for you. This is who we needed to talk to. Hello, Razumdar. Raz's investigations have brought him to Relentil. When this one noticed your Sigic friend slip into town, Raz figured you'd be along soon. So, what did you discover on Arteum, the island that isn't here anymore? Oh, that made Raz's head hurt. Okay, now I remember, because we did a little bit of this quest. We did some of this quest. I'm remembering it now. Um, so there was, like, basically we went to this church, right? And the church was taking all of the immigrants and basically killing them with, uh, forget who. They were basically using, like, Daedric, Daedric demons and lords. I don't know why I was doing this the whole time, but it's what happened. Uh, to kill all the immigrants. So that's where we're coming from on this quest right here. Mega church? Mega church, bro. We learned the false Aldric belonged to a Daedric cult. Oh, I guess I could have just read this. I literally didn't even read that. <laughs> Daedric cult called the Court of Bedlam. This was before we did Rothgar. This was way before we did Rothgar. Yes. This one has been exploring the Daedra connection as well. But Raz hates Daedra. In Raz's experience, Most people very hate little Daedra. good Daedra. comes from dealing with Daedra or their cultists. And this revelation brings you to Relendil, yes? Yes, but other members of the cult mentioned that something was going to happen in Relendil. That is disturbingly vague. That's how I Why like to do things. Why must cryptic cultists be so... cryptic? Well, Raz saw Valsin we'll huh? head toward Canonry Farmeldo's house. This one suggests we start our investigation of the area there. Okay, okay, we'll go to Farmeldo's. Farmeldo's? Cano Ravi Farmeldo's house? Right. That is where I was supposed to meet Valish Serene. I need to find a game I can play where I can actually pronounce the names. Okay, so we need to go to Canaver Farm Lodos and talk to somebody. We gotta go Help. talk to some people. I oh shit. That's right, I killed a sheep. I've rarely met criminals who are as stupid as they are Ooh. incompetent. Alright, let's just I'll pay the price. That's an expensive sheep though. I feel like I could buy a real sheep for less money. Paw Patrol! Perhaps we should start a tab for you. I should be able to pronounce most names in Paw Patrol. Should. But you never know. Go inside Damn, and we'll discuss nice house, this bro. later. And take off that ridiculous hood. Ridiculous? I'll show you what's ridiculous. I'll oh. show you all! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, veiled threats. That's not good. Veiled threats aren't good. Uh, it's free on Game Pass? I think I've already played it, bro. I bought my kids a couple Paw Patrol games. It's a really easy 2D side-scroller. But I bet I could rage in that, too. Maybe that's what we should do. Maybe I should play some Paw Patrol. And I can rage in Paw Patrol just like SpongeBob SquarePants. Okay, Cannon Reeve, Farma La Diddle You think as Cannon Reeve, I'd be immune Cannon to the troubles Reeve. and that's temper actually of a easy. spoiled and rebellious child. But what distinguished visitors I have today. A wandering sage, a well-dressed Khajiit, and you. What brings such a group to Relentheal? I'd play a Paw Patrol MMO, bro. That could be fire, bro. Mayor Good something? I forgot what the mayor's name is. We're investigating reports of unusual occurrences here in Relin Hill. Rel Relin? I feel like that T is probably silent. Relin Hill. Investigating? For who? Well, there have been three reports this week of someone disappearing. Too. Maybe I'll be and able to my intractable things, son, Nadoril, and his malcontent Bam. friends have been cavorting around the large sinkhole that recently appeared. Oh, shit. They got limestone, bro. It's like living in Florida. You never know when a sinkhole is going to open up a underneath you. You hear about that shit all the time out in Florida, dude. People will be sleeping in their bed 
I remember like 10, 15 years ago, some dude got swollen while he's sleeping in his bed, dude. And his brother like ran into the room and like, it was like a hundred foot hole. Dude was just gone, dude. The mole people got him. All right, Cannon Reeve. Do you think these missing people, the sinkhole and your son's friends are related? That's some heavy accusations. What are you implying? They're just young and proud of their heritage. I wouldn't draw such a harsh conclusion without substantial... Well, I clicked off the screen. And why they're fascinated with the sinkhole, but that doesn't make them criminals. I guess that's true. It doesn't make them criminals. I guess that's a good, that's a fair point. Any objections to us investigating the sinkhole? Paw Patrol! It's unusual for newcomers to encroach upon Altma affairs, especially since we rarely saw any prior to the Queen's decree. If you want to investigate, I won't try to stop you. And if anything happens, maybe it will teach my son to avoid the place. Ultimers are kind of stuck up. Also doesn't help that all the lands used to be marshlands. That's a big true too, dude. The water table underneath all that limestone is pretty big, bro. Pretty big. I'll let you know if we find anything to be concerned about. Raz wants to ask the Cannon Reeve a few more questions. Oh, Raz. Take the Sijik and go investigate the sinkhole. Okay, so we're gonna take the Sijik with us. First, let me collect my daily reward. I didn't do that. I didn't do that on my crafter. Where's my daily reward? No, that's not Fortune it. I always have such a hard time with you, this. My friend. Farewell, my I good still, friend. like, have not learned any of these damn menus. One of these days I will. One of these days I'll learn the menus. There we go, okay. No, that's not what I want. I guess I did already pick it. I didn't think I picked it up. King Shrek, you know it, bro. I didn't think I picked these up, but I guess I accepted it on the beginning screen. Let me get my riding skill up, bro. Hell yeah, riding speed, let's go. Look, we're glowing with inspiration. We're ready. I'll also queue up for a dungeon. Let's queue up for a dungeon while we're looking at sinkholes. They go hand in hand. Okay, good, and I have damage selected this time. I don't have the healer class selected, which is a good start. That's a good start. Okay, is the sinkhole gonna be in here? I find it hard to believe that the sinkhole would be inside this building. Okay, no, it's over here by the way, Shrine. You know what, I need my bear, bro. I need my bear, what am I thinking? What am I thinking not riding my bear? We're not in the snowy place anymore. When we were in the snowy place, it made sense. Plus, I work so hard for this bear. I work so hard for him. It fits King Shrek better, too. Okay, Sijik, come with me. Come with me, ye old Sijik. We must investigate a hole of sinking. Whoa. Dawnbreaker, open the way! What the hell's going on here? Oh, come on! Stupid Daedric interference! I'll be back. I think a donkey mount would... Dude, I would love to be able to have a donkey mount. I don't know what the hell we just witnessed right here. I have no idea what that was. But let's go look at this hole. You know I like to check out a good hole, bro. I'll get some iron while I'm going to. Take our Sijik friend with us. I feel like Sijiks know a thing or two about a good hole. Oh, we got some of that rubyite. Ruberite. Through these the Ruberite. Oh, do they got mud skippers in this game too? I've been wanting to say if you guys watch me at all, you know I have like eight fish tanks. And this looks just like well, not just like a mud skipper, but pretty similar to a mud skipper. And I would love to set up a mud skipper tank. Do a little brackish paludarium with mud skippers. Have you ever wanted to keep mud skippers, Mr. Turpy Turp? Mr. Turpy Turp. I think they're pretty fucking cool. We got a heron over here, too. Can I kill the heron? Oh, we fucked that heron up. We got that heron real good, like. Heron, heron. Where's it all gone? They look cool, but not something I want to keep. That's fair. I think, like, a 20-gallon long or a 40-gallon breeder would be great for them. But they definitely are going to require, like, some specialty care. All right, King Shrek is on the job. Nidoril's mad! 
Oh my god. He attacked Eldon and one what? of those horrible creatures tore off my hood. Sure. Hennepin. I don't know. I don't know what got up her. Got up her kill. All right, Valisarine. That young woman was certainly in a hurry. She sure was. And what was that about Nadoral and an attack? She said that Nadoral attacked someone and something about creatures. Yes. Well, let's be on our guard then. I don't think this sinkhole is completely natural. Uh oh. Its size concerns me. If the ground continues to fall away, it could swallow all of Relenthiel. I haven't observed the sinkhole yet. I don't know how she knows so much about it. You really think it's that dangerous? It certainly feels dangerous. Oh, okay, it feels dangerous, guys. It does figure into the court of Bedlin's plans. Careful. Well, I can't think of a more frightening event than watching Relenthiel get swallowed by a sinkhole. Let's proceed and find out what's going on down here. Remember when we used to watch Wildest Weather on Earth and we'd see all those videos from uh, on the Weather Channel, all those videos of towns being swallowed by uh, swallowed by sinkholes? It's kind of a tongue twister. That shit's gnarly, bro. Best show ever. 100%, dude. That's the one thing I hate about not having cable anymore. I literally haven't watched that show since... Uh, we were like roommates, bro. Such a good show, though. Yeah, let's get these guys. We got a lot right here. Finally, some combat. It's been 10 minutes, and I have 20 minutes. I haven't even gotten into combat besides killing an innocent sheep. An innocent sheep. Take the car. I'll take the gold, whatever that's called. Carpacus? Caparis? I'm having a hard time with words today. I think it's because I'm literally the walls exhausted. And ceiling, they don't look stable. Are we in I'll a sinkhole? If we're in a sinkhole, that's a very catch up with you. bad idea. What are you doing? Are you fixing the sinkhole? What is she doing? Explore the sinkhole caverns. So we're literally in a sinkhole. That seems like the worst idea possible. What show? What up, dude? Um, hope you've been having a good one. Uh, Wildest Weather on Earth, I think is what it was called. It was on uh, the Weather Channel, bro. It was so good, dude. This guy keeps stunning me, and I'm not about it. This guy keeps stunning me. I think we need to go check out this way. I don't know why we're in a sinkhole. That just seems like such a terrible idea. Is there anything cool over here? The one thing I don't like about this game is I haven't found any treasures underneath waterfalls. And that seems like a real, like, disservice to RPGs in general. Did a dungeon earlier in Final Fantasy. I pulled threat and tanked the pack. Either got pissed at the tank. Healers always be getting mad at people, bro. Healers think their shit don't smell, bro. That's the thing about healers, man. Tanks are cocky, DPS is stupid, and healers think their shit don't smell. It's all one big circle of bullshit. I, I play DPS, so, you know, fits. I was taking a lot of damage. <laughs> I bet, bro. Especially if the healers piss at you. Those Yaga creatures. Those Yaga creatures. Okay, I already said I'm ready. Let's do this. Oh, I don't think I've done this one. Scriveners Hall. Scriveners? Scriveners? Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce that. But I haven't done this one. Yeah, I will accept that. Where the hell did everybody go already? Bro. Did I join a dungeon in progress? I don't know where any. I always end up leaving the dungeon on accident. Hold on. Which way do we need to go? How do I find my actual, like, dungeon quest? I don't think I want to go that way. Do I want to go this way? Defeat Rift Master? Okay, maybe we do want to go this way. Uh, wasn't piss at me, was piss at the tank for taking threat back. Oh, got you. I thought you were the tank. I thought you were talking in third person. I literally joining encounter in progress. Okay, there we go. 
No, oh, your DPS, okay. You were running a tank at some point, weren't you? Oh, okay, gonna wanna not get hit by the red stuff. Gonna not wanna get hit by the red stuff. Knowledge! Give Knowledge! Oh, there's more red stuff. I rolled right into red stuff. Good job. Good job, dude. Whoa, what was that? Prepare to block. I command Preparing the to block. Of knowledge. Blocking. Use combustion. Music combustion. I still haven't learned my two hand skills. Okay. I feel like I need to get add ons at some point. Okay, I think I venomed him. I think I venomed him, him up. Taste the anger of these leaflets. Which one is my charge? I think it's one. Yeah, it's one. Okay. Get some more venom stacks on him. Okay, so he has venom stacks on him. Don't know what that does. I should have blocked. I'm gonna use blood feast. Knowledge. Give me okay, is this gonna do something? I can't tell like what anybody, all the enemies attacks are. I don't know what to look for. I want to back up from my group for sure. Ooh, that hurt. Yo, that hurt. My power fills these tones. Maybe we want to kill the ads. Oh, oh, we all died. Summoners have a large burst window. I haven't tanked an FF yet. I tanked in WoW. Gotcha. I don't know what killed me. I don't kill me. I don't know any of the mechanics. I'll just okay. I'll use a way shrine, or I'll use a chingad arrow. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what killed me. Let me tell them I don't know the mechanics. Foolish heroes to follow oh, an too old late. fool. How fitting. Okay, well, I have group chat set up, so next time. Okay, let me call my little thing down. I think this will help everybody. Get some poison. Should probably... Oh, uh, I also haven't put any food buffs on. Should probably do that at some point. Give me reserve. I feel like I should kill some of the ads. I don't know, but... I feel like it's always a good idea to take care of the ads. In here. I need to look up my skills, like, for sure. I don't know any of my skills. Okay, prepare to block. I'm blocking. What's that doing for me? Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm hurt. I'm hurt. Use combustion. Dude, we're getting wrecked. Still. We're getting wrecked. Put a book through your skull. I think our healer's dead. Yeah, something's not going right here. I need to, um... I'm gonna ask what's going wrong here. What's going wrong here? I don't know the mechanics. I mean, I guess that's probably... Yeah, I probably answered my own question. Oh, I almost died as soon as I came back, too. That's awesome. You Love to see that. No one gets through me. Huh. Are we just not getting healed? Like I don't understand why I'm dying so quick. I don't understand what's going on here. I don't really understand. I think we all wiped again. Let me eat some food before you guys fucking do shit. This is why I watch videos in FF. Yeah, but you know I'm not gonna do that. You already know I'm not gonna be prepared. Hold a logger, recover health. Okay. Follow an old fool. You guys I'll are doing shit before you. I can even fucking equip my potions. Let me try my other class. The double head handed wasn't working. Oh my god. Oh no. no. Oh no. Oh my god. This isn't good. Check the recap if you die again. I die I'll I died again. Let's see. Let's take a gander here. Oh, except. I know that like I don't want to stand in the red things, right? Like I understand that much. Prepare to block. Okay, I blocked, but it's still fucking 
Hurt me. Still hurt me. I'm strong. We throw rocks at him. Oh my god, what was that? Hey, prepare to block. I don't know what I'm preparing to block from. I know I don't want to pull this guy's aggro though. Huh. Toggle recap. Cyclone Frost, Bleeding, Slice, Freezing Codex. Lots of things. You must dual wield to use twin strikes. Okay. The presence of hidden knowledge deals frequent damage. Destroy the tomes that reflect each codex. Okay, where are the tomes at? Oh no, I spawned right next to the boss. Where are the tomes? You're definitely getting hit by a lot of stuff. Yeah, I am. 100%. 100%. You should have done your research Where are the tomes at? challenging me. I don't see any tomes. Is this the tome? No, this is our guy's thing, right? Do I need to be further zoomed out? Do I need to not be right in it? Is this a tome? Can I attack this thing? I'm not seeing anything. I'll batter your bones Compliment you? Covers. You took a very stinky poop today, and I'm super proud of you because it smelled really bad, and that way I know that you're actually my son. Ooh. I don't see where the tome is. Where the fuck is the tome? Our records will be smeared with your blood. Oh my god. Fill books with your blood. Uh, oh my god, dude. It's saying the tomes, right? But where are the fucking tomes? Destroy the tomes. Reflect each code. Destroy the tomes that reflect each codex. I don't see the fucking tome. Here I go the game, not gonna lie. I'm bad at the game, not gonna lie. Like, I'm getting one shot as soon as I come in. Unstable literature must be properly mitigated by a willing individual. I don't know what that means. I have no idea what that means. This is a frustrating start to my ESO experience. I'm going to go back and play Roblox. We're going to stop the stream and we're going to go play Roblox. I had more fun playing Roblox yesterday than I'm having fun with this. The book is a codex. I know what a f I know that, but I can't attack it. But I can't attack it, bro. Foolish heroes to follow an old fool. They're going too quick. I can't fucking How equip anything. Quick slot. I'm just gonna die while I fucking wait to get my health on. Oh, I can't equip it because I'm in combat. Thanks, cocksuckers. I guess I'll just kill these fools. Okay, I literally, I see this book, right? Is someone supposed to just stand under the fucking book? I don't see where you guys burp. Ugh. Almost threw up in my mouth right there. Oh my god. Oh, this sucks. Look at me again. A lot of shit is getting me. The burning codex is what's really doing all the damage, though. Your necklace is low level. Hydrate. Go to bed, dude. What are you doing? You got school tomorrow. Spending all your points, bro. No one's saying anything. Tips? Can't melee? Well, oh, I'm fuck. I didn't see it, so it doesn't count. Dude, I'm fucking, I'm bailing Foolish on this dungeon. To follow an old oh my god. How fitting. I'm bailing. I'm fucking rage quitting this dungeon. How do I get out of here? 
How do I be a dick and rage quit? I can't. Group. Leave instance. Yes. Hey, what up, kitty? Welcome on in. I'm just rage. I'm rage quitting in uh in this dungeon right here. You damn right, I'm a loser. You know my philosophy with video games, Terp. If I'm not having a good time, I'm not gonna keep fucking doing it. If I'm not having a good time, I ain't gonna keep doing it. Literally, life is way too short to just keep getting frustrated with like a dungeon that I clearly don't know what I'm doing and the group doesn't know what they're doing either. Don't tell me you've never quit a fucking key, bro. I've seen you quit keys. Okay. Let's go back in here. We're gonna investigate the sinkhole. We're gonna get back into the sinkhole. We'll do the easy stuff. Keep it easy. Keep it easy. We'll see you French fried when you should have pizza. The yeah, that's true. That's true. That's a good point. He attacked Eldon and one of those horrible we're starting this all over again. Damn it. That's I wish the quest would pick up where you left off. When you dive to prone, it's gonna shake you to the bone. All the zombies gonna groan. That's true. That's true too. That's a good point. You guys are bringing up really good points. That was such a frustrating dungeon. Okay, lady, come over here and talk about the hole. Come on. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? I'm talking about the hole, lady. All right, night cam. Have a good one, dude. That young woman was. Right, we already know that she's gonna come over here. She's gonna talk about a hole, and then we're gonna go do something else. Come on. Come on. The walls and ceiling, they don't look stable. I'll try to reinforce yeah. the walls. Also a good point. And catch also up super with valid. Also a super valid point. Okay, we need to. Go explore the sinkhole more. Again, I still stand by the fact that I think it's super dangerous to be in a sinkhole right now. I don't think we should be in here. Rubidite battle axe. Not good. Not good. Ooh. I'd also like a salamander as a pet, too. I think salamanders would be pretty cool. I think a salamander would be pretty damn cool. Uh, let me just pull all these guys. You guys can come with me. You guys come with me over here. We're gonna mess with this guy. Damn. They actually got some hits off. More of those Yagra creatures. They actually got some hits off. Yo, what up, Ethan? How's it going? Now we got a whole bunch of cats in here, huh? The size of this place. It's almost as if someone dug hey, we're getting up a lot of good vendor loot. Island. I'll teleport closer to the central area and meet That's you That's a good there. point. I don't know where she is. Every now and then she just disappears, and I'm not sure why. Where is Ember? Where is... God, I literally keep pressing the wrong buttons. Collections. It's going good. Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. Allies. I also have this Isabel person, but I've never really messed with her. I like Ember. We're gonna we'll use the cat for all the cats in chat. Alright. Where's Ember go? See? We got my Khajiit. Look out, everyone. Tamriel's there you go. Duo is That's for you, back. Kitty. Alright. That's for you. Ember's my backup. We gotta explore the sink a little bit more. Is someone there? I'm here. Help! Okay. Please help! What's up, Eldon? Crazy bastard! Stabbed Ooh, me! Everyone's getting Dogs. stabbed all the time. This hurts! Alright, tell me what happened. It was just kind of fun. Joining the court of Bedlam. Espousing the virtues of our Ultima heritage. But Medoral, he took things too far. Oh, Nadoro. That name sounds familiar. What do you mean, too far? 
When we heard that they planned to re release those creatures. Who's in the background? Who's back I here? I made the mistake of saying they were insane. What's up, Kit Kat? Lots of cats the on YouTube, bro. Objected. What up, Kit Kat? How you Call doing? me unworthy. That's did you bring, he Kitty, did you bring your whole cat family me. with you? If so, I appreciate it. I have three cats at my house, so if we got three cats in stream, that seems pretty on point. Eldon, where's Neo, Neo Drill now? Isn't there a Pokemon with a very similar name? You're doing good. Glad to hear that. Glad to hear that. Welcome to the stream. We're playing some Elder Scrolls Online. The court of Bedlam will eradicate the lesser oh. races. I didn't think he was like that dead. Maybe even deal with our unworthy queen. Yes, you did. All right, good, good. Yeah, and then we got we got for you cat folks out there. I got my helper, Ember. She's a Khajiit. She's a magic wielding cat of chaos. And I'm uh, Shrek. I'm big old Shreky boy over here. Do fire magic, poison, and what else do I do? I throw rocks at people too. I like to throw rocks. Facts. 100%. 100% factual based stuff here. Over here. Oh, here she is. Keep quiet. There's Sigic. Tell me if you see what I see. There is a Beedrill. Doesn't it morph into something else? Oh, I'm thinking of like Ned Nido Duran. Neto Duran or some shit. Okay, this holds up to no good over there. What the hell is that thing? That thing looks sketchy. You see that, right? I see it. My eyes aren't playing tricks on me. That's a sea slode. They haven't been seen in some Need a little revive? Since... Well, it's been you centuries gotta, you gotta, you gotta at stay least. fresh, you know? Uh, what, what do they call this? That's a sea slode? Okay. What's a sea slode? A vile and dangerous species. I believe it. Very powerful. Nidoran, yeah, that's what I was thinking. The sea slowed come from the distant underwater kingdom of Ulvorkus. Who's that hooded figure with the slowed? And look, more of those abyssal pearls. They're everywhere. Does this have something to do with the Court of Bedlam? The hooded figure could be a member of this so-called Court of Bedlam. At this point, nothing would surprise me. Reach for that Juggernaut tonight. I don't even know what Juggernaut though. is, but I'm going to reach for it, bro. I can't think of anything reach for it every time, an alliance between those I'm always trying to go for that Juggernaut, you know? And Daedric cultists. I'm stuck in my shirt, though, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to get Juggernaut. I can't even get out of my shirt. I don't know, then. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Could this uh, be the source of the abyss, abyssal pearls? They could certainly have a connection to the Sea Slode submerged kingdom, but they appear to have been placed down here. Look From how the Yogra are drawn to them. Black Ops I'll do? I'll for the Sea Slode. You deal with those abyssal pearls. Okay, I'll destroy the pearls. Then I'll make you a pretty pearl necklace, don't you worry. Intruders in the cave. Heed me, my creatures! Yeah, okay. Destroy the intruders! Young idiot. Oh we need to get over there. A young idiot. Witness I went to my friend's house the other day. Of the abyssal cabal. I went for this guy to stop fucking yelling like a rude asshole. I went to my friend's house the other day and he has two pugs. And he had pearl necklaces on both his pugs. It took a lot of, for me not to say something. It took a lot not to say something, Turt. We gotta go, uh, we gotta go collect some pearls, kill some slodes, you know, run of the mill stuff here. This way, we're almost there. Run of the mill. Facts, 100% facts. In the zombie mode? I thought you could be Juggernaut in other modes too. Or was that later Call of Duties? I would have said something off the bat. Probably why I'm not invited, probably, bro. Destroy the pearls! We can't let those creatures reach the surface. Hey, well, where are the pearls? The sea slowed and the hooded figure are gone. I'll try to determine where they disappeared to. Okay, Sigic. Hey, a lead for high elf all time. I totally forgot about scrying, dude. I haven't done scrying for so long. We have to start doing some scrying pretty soon here. Uh, 
Let's this. Throw this thing down. This seems like a good idea. Throw a little bit of that in. Okay, I'll get smacked. That worked. That worked. Uh, let me get this pearl. I think that is later. You can get that in multiplayer. Oh, okay. Oh, we got a bunch of pearls. We got a bunch of pearls. Free fire at him. Free some fire at these bulls. Free fire and throw rocks, like an orc would do. You know. This way. Typical Up orc here. stuff. Up where? Where are you? Where? Where'd you go, lady? Oh, I see a path. Oh, I see a path. Okay, what are we Damn. doing? No sign of where the sea slow disappeared to. Oh yeah, we were hiding over there. Well, come on, you're Sigic. Aren't you supposed to be super smart? The sea slow left us something to remember it by. We Let's need see. to dispatch that creature. The Yagar monstrosity. Okay, I'm down. Damn it! I wasn't fast enough. Where is she talking from? Probably her butt, if I had imagined. She looks like she talked from her butt. So that's it. Is he slow to escape? For the time being, let's see what's through that opening. Yeah, see? The opening is her butt. Facts. Hard facts. Okay, you always want to jump down and hurt yourself before you start fighting anybody. That's my first tip to you guys. Oh my god, what is around us? What's going on here? That's a lot of buffs on me. I don't even know what those do. I don't even know what anything does. Got 25 there. gold though. I think we can get out over there. Facts, words, and stats. What up, Mr. Wolf? How you doing tonight, brother? How you doing, brother? We're just defeating some slows. I did a dungeon, but I had a tantrum, so now I'm just doing story missions. I got cranky with the dungeon because I didn't know what I was doing. So I'm going to kill this bird, too. Just to help. That's what a cat would do. A cat would kill that bird. I'm trying to keep the cats in my chat happy by killing birds unnecessarily. I'm not even going to eat them. I'm just going to kill them. Leave their corpses. Just messing with the new Arcanus and ESO. This oh, cool, is dude. worse than the right master imagined. Meet me in our tail. Getting that I ESO on too? To I didn't even know there was a new class, dude. I don't pay attention. I don't even pay attention, bro. Did the pretty Sigic say Sea Slod? She did. No. Raz must have heard wrong. Oh, with that the Necrom? Could not okay. What she said. Yeah, I don't have the Necrom expansion. The Sea Slod Ketora. Is working with the court of Bedlam, including the Khan Reeve's son. Slod, that's bad. That is bad. And Sea Slod, that sounds even worse. <laughs> it's bird. If the Sea Slod threatens yeah, Somerset, Queen Irene must be informed. We need to act. Wait, what did you say about the Canon Reeve's son? I feel like my cats don't eat birds, but they'll eat like rats and lizards and shit. They'll kill birds, but I only ever see them eat fucking rats, rats and mice. Neodor, Nidoril, Nedoril, Ned joined the court of Bedlam. He killed a fellow initiate, initiate and was working with the Slod. Daedra worshippers in Somerset. Yeah. And Slod. Yeah. Oh, Roz likes this situation less and less. As for Nedoril, Roz knows how to deal with traitors. This one will meet you at the Cannon Reeves house. I'll see you there, buddy. He knows how to deal with traitors. We're in good hands here. We're in good hands here. How do I get to his house? Okay, we're going back over there. Get on my big old sexy bear. Get on my big old sexy bear over here. And off we go. My guy's got a pretty nice butt, too. He's kind of thick. His voice does not match his face. The Khajiit? Yeah. But I feel like very little of the Khajiit's voice actually ma match their, uh... Khajiit's voice actually match, match their face. Now, the Argonians, on the other hand, they match up a lot better. For the most part. I bet this guy's got a bunch of weird bondage shit going on in this house. 
Let's see. Oh, you must be hiding it in a the back room. The eye of the queen? How dare you accuse my son of treason? That's it. All right, Canon Reeve. The queen's eye. How dare he not identify himself when he first arrived? And how dare he accuse my foolish son of something as serious as treason? The queen shall hear of this. Mark my words. Ned's more foolish. More than foolish. He killed a high elf and is working with the sea slode. Sea slode? Plus all this nonsense about Altma's superiority and now murder? I am the Cannon Reeve of Relenthil. I took an oath to serve and protect my community. What the hell's a Cannon Reeve? How in the Queen's no name am I supposed to reconcile like my son's actions? Old timey. Frickin' neighborhood watch. Hugs Kitty? Dude, you sound like my wife. My wife is always walking around hugging the cats. This is not something I can help you with, Cannon Reeve. Oh, Nadoril, what have you done? Please. You must talk to the Queen's eye. He needs to show mercy. I'm sure we can find a way to resolve this without... Oh, here comes well, Nadoril here he comes. now. We're gonna catch him in the act. Your son has a lot of answer, a lot to answer for. I have a lot to answer for? The court of Bedlam is going to oh, turn me into shit. a god! Foolishness can be ignored. Murder and treason, not so much. Yeah, I agree. You and your Queen have no authority over a true Ultima. You mangy cat. This one cannot allow your crimes oh, to stand just kill his unanswered. Son in front of him, bro. No! No! I understand. Relenthil is loyal to the Queen. Wow. Wow, epic, bro. Well, I mean, that took care of that. You know, while he's grieving, we should probably steal stuff from him. We should probably take this opportunity to steal things from him while he's grieving. Perfect. I think this is the right thing to do. I think, you know, he's got a lot on his mind right now. He doesn't need all these extra things weighing him down. We're going to help him out. And then when he discovers everything's... Your streams are good? Oh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, while he's, um... While he's grieving, we're going to take his things. And then when he's done grieving, he's going to want to buy more things. And now he'll have plenty of room. He'll have plenty of room to store more of his stuff. We'll, uh, we'll just go this way. We'll go in here. We're doing it for him. We're not doing this for ourselves. We're just trying to be good neighbors. Facts. You got good facts. Your facts are pretty on point. Your facts are pretty on point. Who's, who's, uh, who, uh, who we got up here? Is this the mom? I don't know if this is the mom. We should probably steal from her too, though. Ooh, I don't think we're going to be able to steal over there. Oh, she's got some gold right here. Got it. Okay, another lead. I need to work on my scrying, I think. It's like when I was playing Rocket League the other day. You said meow, and then you just came out with like a bunch of crisp knowledge. Sometimes the eye sees treason and must cut it out before it spreads. This one is sorry you had to witness that. He was like a cancer. This guy's the surgeon, and that dude was a cancer. And he cut him the fuck out of the situation. Couldn't you have just arrested him? Blasphemy. Treason. I don't Murder. think they should have arrested him. I think they made the How right decision. How many crimes Meow must indeed. one commit Meow to indeed. attract the attention of the executioner's blade? Raz decided that a message had to be sent. Enemies of the queen will not be tolerated. Okay. Raz made the decision. He's the judge, jury, and executioner. I've rarely seen you this serious, Raz. Treason and the queen's justice are serious business. That's true. Raz has been forced into this role on rare occasions, but he never seeks it out or looks he forward did that without to hesitation. wielding the blade. A necessary part of my job, yes. That's true. There are a lot of baddies out there I need to send to hell. That's true. Is there anything else you need to do for me right now? Or anything else you need from me right now? I can read, guys. 
I swear, I know it looks like on stream that I can't read, but I promise you guys I can read. <sighs> no. Raz will time. see to the Cannon Reeve and send word to the Queen before looking deeper into the court of Bedlam. You should return to Arteum and let the Sijiks know what we learn. These damn Sijiks, bro. I tell you, Five Claw. This whole situation makes Raz Five Claw. Why are you calling me Five Claw? Does I have fingers? Don't you have five fingers too, bro? Yeah. We all have the same amount of digits. Why are you being all weird about it? Let's count this guy's. How many fingers you got? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I can't really see because his hands are crossed. But I'm going to assume he has a thumb too. So it just seems like kind of a weird thing to call me out. To call me out on, you know? Okay, we're going to go talk to the right master of Arteum. Arteum? I don't know. I don't know these words. Where do we go for that? I think we have to fast travel somewhere. Oh no, we just got to go over here. Okay. See what adventures we can find on our way. I kind of want to queue up for another dungeon, but I also don't want to, like, cry. I don't want to get all frustrated. I like dungeons. That one just sucked. Oh, what? We got silk? Dude, I can make some nice, comfortable boxers out of this. I haven't had silk anything in a long time. Silk is great, though. And Terp, now that you said I should have a donkey, I'm kind of bummed I don't have a donkey mount. Eats bird, oof. You at least like pull some of the feathers out first or you just go right for it? I feel like you could, I feel like you could choke on a feather. They're pretty pokey, you know? I would pull the feathers out if I was a cat. I imagine that that's what they do. Getting right for it, damn. No fucks given, huh? Now you're just gonna have messed up hairballs. Half hair, half feather. You gotta live your best life, I get it. You gotta live the best life you got. I ain't here to stop you. Yeah, I'm not here to stop you, you live it. If you basically want a raw dog, that, that bird, that's that's your option. I would at least pluck a little bit of it. Maybe not though. So I guess you're probably not eating the wings, right? You probably rolled it over and just went right for the good meaty gut. And then of course, as cats do, you're gonna leave the intestines everywhere. You're not gonna eat the intestines because cats are too good to eat intestines. They just leave that shit on the ground for everybody to find. Damn cats. There's a guy at my work who's not like super bright. He's a nice kid. But I think he's I literally I think he's on like the spectrum a little bit. And he was trying to convince me that like one of the cats had a miscarriage. And I was like trying to explain to him, like, bro, that's not a miscarriage. That's just like the that's the guts of a rat. Like they ate a rat and they don't eat the intestines. And after like 10 minutes, he finally believed me. He, th he thought like a cat had a miscarriage. I would pluck the feather. See, Ethan gets it. Me and Ethan are on the same page, bro. Me and Ethan are on the same page when it comes to consuming avian creatures. Look, Kitty's probably just a little more gangster cat than we are. A little more OG cat, you know? I'm more like a house cat. Way more house catty on it. Get these runestone. Well, at some point in time, I'll actually do something with runestones. But for now, I'm just picking Watching them up. Harvest is exciting. I can't Ember likes it when I pick up runestones, so... That. It's kind of a win-win. Kind of a win-win. We like to keep Ember happy. We like to keep all the cats... ...satisfied, you know? And we went through there. This is a pretty area. And we got, like, lemurs. Come on, I want to look at the lemur. Look at that. A lemur. They call it a ringtail, but they're calling it a lemur. It's pretty cute when it's dead, too. That's actually a super good death animation. Like, that looks like a dead rodent. Rode is this guy in the thumbnail you? That is me with... I So I took my picture, 
and I put it into CapCut, and I said, using this image, make me look like an orc from the Elder Scrolls Online, and it, it gave me that one. And I was like, damn, dude, I look pretty beefcakey. I'm for sure gonna use that image, dude. I'm gonna false advertise what this actually looks like and get people to click on the stream. I think it worked. It definitely brought the cats in, bro. It brought in the kitties. So, I mean, that's a win. But that's my face. It looks like you with a really good jawline. Yeah, it gave me like the the cap cut program was like pretty generous. You know? It was pretty generous. I got a solid jawline, but I don't have that good of a jawline. I don't I mean it did, right? Yeah, it's working as in intended. Working as intended. You know, the strippers never look as good once you bring them home as they do in the club either. So, you know, I don't feel bad about what I'm doing here. I don't feel bad about what I'm doing. But yeah, I tried using that program too to take my face and turn it into a SpongeBob character for my SpongeBob stream. And it could just not, it could not figure it out. Yeah, I've certainly been getting a lot of new people in the streams. Yeah, I think streaming a lot of different shit helps. I think just like not only streaming one thing. Cause like I know myself, like I don't like to watch people play the same shit over and over again. So, and I don't like to play the same shit over and over again. So it kind of works out. Well, it kind of works out. And you know, if you trick them with the fake Chad, you know, if they think they're about to get like a Chad, and they come in and they're like, oh, oh fuck, I already clicked on it. I guess I'll fucking hang out for a minute. Oh fuck. Let's see what this fucking idiot's doing. That's how I try to market myself. Let's just see what this idiot is doing. It, it works. Says you who played ESO for the past two months. Yeah, well, thou, I haven't only played of ESO. Thousarin, I've been informed that you encountered a sea slode in a sinkhole beneath Relentheal. That bodes ill for Somerset, perhaps all of Nern. I fear there are difficult days ahead. I play ESO three out of the seven days in a week. So. I actually play ESO less than I do other things. Mr. Yovan. Mr. Yovan Bajilik. So there. Your names are almost as hard as the names in fucking Elder Scrolls, bro. The, the sea slowed called it Ketora. I'm familiar now, with that particular see, sea slowed and point. its renegades. These guys got a good point. Call themselves the Abyssal Cabal. I thought I defeated them long ago, but it appears I was in error. I got a cat pack, bro. Valserin mentioned you encountered more in deep. the sinkhole. We're gonna give you cat scratch fever? Yeah, scratch you, you're gonna get a little infection under your skin. You're not gonna know what to do about it. You need antibiotics? Who knows? Who knows? You're gonna have to go to the doctor and find out. For a while you streamed only ESO and sometimes for like five plus hours. Yeah, I was streaming a lot of ESO. I'm just fucking with you. I streamed, uh, I streamed a lot of it because, um, Essentially, what was happening is I was getting closer and closer to affiliate on Twitch streaming ESO. So I figured, like, don't look a gift horse in the mouth or whatever that expression is. Um, but I have noticed, like, on so, like, Twitch and YouTube are different, different markets. Like, I know the other games I was playing on uh, YouTube do better than, like, ESO does, right? But I actually make money off of Twitch. Well, money, like, $2 a stream if I'm lucky off of Twitch while I'm not monetized on YouTube. So it's like a fine balance, bro. But the plan is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, stream Elder Scrolls. Thursdays, I'm going to start doing uh, play test first impression videos. Oh, I saw ad just start. Talk about the $2. But yeah, um, Thursdays will be first impression videos. And then Fridays are going to be new Fallout, Fallout 3, and then Saturdays and Sundays are going to be whatever the hell I want. Katora used abysmal pearls to summon Yagra to attack Relentil. See how many weird words there are in one sentence in this game? Val described those seaborne monstrosities. I have a vague recollection of Katora utilizing such creatures in the past, but for some reason, the okay. memories refuse to snap into focus. Oh, he's I got suppose dementia. that's another mystery I'll need to look into. 
Why would the De Daedric Prince require the aid of the sea slodes? The Daedric Princes require minions oh. to carry out their will, and the Slode have always had an interest in the green and pleasant island. It isn't hard to see why they might work together. For now, you have my thanks for assisting Valserin. Uh, I think we'll keep the sword we have. Right, we'll take the 664 gold. I asked the gold. Conclave of the Eleven Forces to ponder how we can learn more from the Abyssal Pearl. With the additional information you provided, I expect that Iridel or Amalira will be able to develop a new avenue of investigation now. Nice. Okay. Well, our pearl necklace is complete, so that's a good sign. You're playing uh, Age of Empires 2? That's dope, bro. Uh, they have, like, all of the Age of Empires on, um, what's it called? On the Battle Pass? Or not on the Battle Pass. On Xbox Game Pass. So I've been thinking about playing some of those, but in general, I find that city strategy games really aren't very entertaining to watch. What more do you hope to learn from the Abyssal, Abyssal Pearl? The augury ritual revealed the connection to the court of Bedlam and pointed to trouble in Relenthil. Now we need to determine where Katora and the Sea Slodes are hiding. The Abyssal Pearl should be able to point us in the right direction. Well, how can I help you, buddy? Meet me in the main gallery. We can consult with the rest of the Conclave and use the scrying pool to continue our probe of the Pearl. As much as this situation concerns me, I must admit, I somewhat enjoy being in the oh, middle of the action again. he likes it. Again. It's exciting for him. All right, I'll meet you in the main gallery. Keep your britches on, bro. Right, Master. The Abyssal Pearl. It's gone. They already gone. lost a pearl. How? I set the protections personally. We literally just gave them the pearl and they already lost it. But yeah, Age of Empires is a dope game, bro. I haven't played that for a long time, though, dude. I haven't played that one for a long time. How you liking it? Okay, or Oriandra? Oriandra. How could the Abyssal Pearl disappear like that? That's what I was asking. It makes no sense. When was the last time anyone saw it, besides for 32 seconds ago, when I gave it to you? A few hours ago. A few hours we ago? We left it in the scrying pool in the main gallery while the members of the Conclave of the Eleven Forces went to deal with other matters of importance. When I returned, I immediately noticed that the pearl was missing. Um, didn't the right master place, like, some kind of protection on this pearl? Yes, okay. that's standard okay. procedure when dealing with an unknown relic. But that just makes the pearl's disappearance more troubling. It does. Something about this feels wrong. RTS games or turn-based strategy games? Both. Meow. Yep. Meow. That's true. Yep. Meow. Meow to RTS games and meow to turn-based strategy games as well. I like both of them, but I feel like it's really boring to watch. All right, we'll get to the bottom of this. Oriandra. I think I actually pronounced her name right. I think I got her name right this time. There we go. There's Kitty for you guys. There's Kitty. She's kind of like a punk rock kitty. She's kind of punk rock over here. You want to talk about something? Let's talk about her partnership. All right. Here we go. But for you can guys. we do it best? How do you feel about her friendship? Traveling with you is a good time. Better than sitting around reading books. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about something What's else. What's going on? What's up? What you got packing? What are you packing over here? I need to get her a necklace. I need to get her a pearl necklace. Just like those pugs at my buddy's house. We're like cordial. I thought we'd be tighter, dude. She's been adventuring with me for 180 hours. All right, thank you, Ethan. Oh, yeah, like this video and subscribe, people. Join the cat pack. Slognark's cat pack, bro. It's going down. That's going to be my new branding. The next YouTube thumbnail is just going to be a cat with a super chiseled AI jaw. It's going to be hot. It's going to be super hot. Uh, let's go to the portal of Mariah Carey. Oh, main gallery. Close. Close. And facts. They're facts. They're meow facts, which are the best kind of facts. <laughs> See what the scrying pool reveals. There's something reveals, yeah. happening on the beach. It's the Yagra. They're invading Arteum. 
The pearl. Somehow it was used to summon the Yagra. We need to defend the beach. Wait, is that a sword? I don't know that how the hell they got this pearl. Mine. That's blowing I'm my on mind. My way to help. Eventually. The Golden Knight and his sword can wait. The Yagra are our primary concern. Uh, I wonder how handsome the guy playing this character is. I'm guessing the guy that plays that character is... Let's see here. I think he lives in Tennessee. He's 176 pounds. And... Has like gold blonde hair, but he's slightly balding. That's how I'm thinking that is. How's my day? My day is good, thank you. Yeah, it's, it was fine. I went to work. I weed whipped a lot of stuff. Uh oh, here we go. One piece. See, I'm using this arm now, dude. I'm using this arm now. Because if I use this arm, I hit it on my fucking table the whole time. Yo, what's up, bro? I didn't get to dance like an asshole yet, so I'm glad you came in, man. It doesn't feel right to dance like an asshole, like, without that song now, so... I wait to look like a complete dumbass until you get here. But yeah, no, work, uh... Today was good, just worked a bunch, weed whipped a bunch of shit. Fucking manual labor, you know, I do manual labor eight hours a day, so... Doesn't change a whole lot. Not a whole lot different in each day. Win on a crazy win streak? And what, what game were you playing, bro? The scrying pool revealed that Yagra had invaded our island. They must have somehow used the Abyssal Pearl to open a pathway. We need to get down to the beach Grinding and repel mobile. the invaders. Grinding the mobiles. What about you, Kit Kat? How was your day? What did you get into today? And for you, right, Master, why are the Yagra invading the island? The Sea Sloat have always been envious of Arteum and its secrets. From the beach, they can reach the ruins of the College of Sigix, where we store relics and other items of arcane significance. If the Sea Sloat acquire any of those artifacts. See, so God here says, I got MVPS support and we lost, and I kind of just took out my frustration. What you take out your frustration on? On the win streak? He said, fuck it, now I'm winning everything? You played Cold War? Oh, that's pretty cool. I haven't played Cold War for a minute. I felt like Cold War was pretty janky when it first came out. Like, it felt, like, kind of arcadey. But the more I played it, the more I, the more I started to get into it. I think my wife will pick it up and play Cold War every now and then as well. The future competition jumped, like, two ranks. Nice, dude. Grind it out. Just insta-locking ADC or GNG, JNG. I don't know what that means, but I bet you did it, like, super cool. I bet it was a pretty cool thing you did. I bet you're all like, fuck, man. I just ADC JNG, JNG those fools. They didn't even see it coming. They thought I was going to JNG them, and then I came over with the ADC, and they're like, yo, what the fuck? What the fuck? Cold sore, you should uh, go see a doctor. No, nah, it's fine. I just bite them off. I bite them off. I swallow them. It's all good, bro. Yeah, no, Cold War was pretty cool. Cold War was pretty cool. I liked it. It wasn't the best Call of Duty, but it's fun enough. Got to round 43 on Forsaken. What is that? Is that like a mode they have? I don't know what Forsaken is. Are we talking about Call of Duty Cold War? No, we're or are we talking about something else? It's a map? Okay. I didn't know there were rounds in Call of Duty. What am I missing? There's just like a there's like a hamster wheel spinning in my brain, but nothing's coming. Might be the zombies. Oh, is it a zombie mode? Oh, okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. You miss yeah, I was missing the zombie part. I have played zombies in Black Ops or in any Call of Duty. For maybe a total of an hour or two. I played it with Terp way back in the day. But I don't, I'm, uh, this might be a hot take, but I do not enjoy the zombie modes. But I'm glad that you do. And 43 is a pretty high number. So 
That's pretty dope, too. What's the max? Like 50? If the Yager are attacking by the beach, how did the Pearl get down there? Someone jacked our fucking Pearl. That's what happened. Someone came up and they shanghaied our fucking Pearl. That's a mystery we can solve after we deal with the immediate problem. We need to get down to the beach, destroy the Pearl, and close the Yagra's portal. Will you I aid have me to join in the these gag endeavors? Game. I might have to join it. I'll help you destroy the Pearl. Oh, Follow he's ready. Right he master. said, yeah, fuck, let's I'll go, bro. Let's go destroy this Pearl. There. Their positions and word. positions and MOBA. JNG is jungle. ADC is attack damage carry. Usually ranger hunters. Then there's supped, which is support or tank. Solo is a hybrid DPS tank in the solo lane. And then mid is a mage in the mid lane. That's a lot of terms, bro. That's a lot of terms. I appreciate you uh, dropping the knowledge on me, bro. I remember jungle. I remember J and G as jungle. And uh, that's probably the only information I'm going to retain from that. Probably the only information I'll retain from that. We do the cat gang and we can all get fucking matching cat ears. That'd be fucking dope. Baby steps. That's right, bro. Baby steps 100%. Terp, when are you going to send me some cat ears, bro? Mage in mid lane sounds like a song. <laughs> it does. It does. But I can't tell if it would be like... Like a heavy metal song? Or like kind of like a depressing song, you know? I'm just a lonely mage in the mid lane. I'm a lonely mage with no mana. I think that's how mage in the mid lane would go. Or it'd be hardcore, dude. Or it'd be like screamo music, you know? I'm the mage in the hard lane. I'm a mage in the middle lane. Those are my two takes on mage in the middle lane. Uh, my album will be dropping probably sometime in August. I'm working on a few more songs, but those are what I'm starting with. Sounds like a fucking miracle with the teams I get, I get in ranked. I believe it, dude. No uh, compositional awareness. Yeah, you're probably playing with people like me. You wouldn't wear cat ears? I'd wear a fucking cat ear, bro. Chat redeem for cat ears? Yeah, absolutely. Every single Halloween for the past six years, my wife has worn just a pair of little black cat ears. Every year. She won't do the whiskers. She won't do the other stuff. That would be a good cat redeem, though. I could just get different animals. We should just, you know what? Let's just turn this into a furry stream, bro. I feel like we're halfway there. We might as well just, like, go full fucking kill. Let's go, you know, go big or go home. Isn't that what they say? I don't know if they say that in the furry community, too. There's probably something cuter for that term. But uh, that's what I'm thinking, dude. Okay, we need to travel to Blood Main Mine. See, she would wear them, not you. That's true, but she wouldn't even show herself on the stream. Make it like a 40k or something. Gotta wear cat ears all stream. I know, I know P Daddy's got the poop ears. I know P Daddy's got them poop ears. Okay, what are we doing? This is not right. I need to go back to Somerset. Yeah, this is better. This is better. I don't think, are we in Somerset right now? I guess we are. Okay, go to the Southeast Beach. Get the cool cat glasses, man. I just want to be one cool cat. I want to be as cool of a cat as Ember is. Look at that mount I gave Ember. Ember is a cat, and I gave her a fucking saber-toothed tiger to ride. Okay? I'm keeping the cats looking good. I buy them, you wear them every stream. Oof. I might just spend the $1.50 on Etsy. Then. <laughs> I'll drop that $1.50. Turn slog into... Uh, Nikimo... Nuki, Nikomimi? I don't even know what that is. Doing I don't think I'd make magic? a good version of it if I don't know what it is. Maybe that'd be perfect. But see, I would buy good cat ears. You would buy, like, high-quality cat ears. Made with real cat skin. <laughs> yeah. These are from Thailand. They're made from real cats.
I don't know if they do that in Thailand. I'm trying to think of somewhere random where they might actually harvest cats. I also need to work on my furnishing with my crafter. But yeah, Turp, Turp wouldn't buy that good shit. Make sure you run the purchase through an expert before uh, hand to make sure you're getting a real deal. You know a guy? You know a cat guy? Perfect, bro. Perfect. China? Probably. I've never really heard of China eating cats, though. I've heard of, like, the joke. Like, Chinese restaurants serving cats, I guess. I've never seen, like, cats in cages in China. I feel like it's always dogs. It's always dogs and, like, goose. Goose's is. Goose's size? Something like that. Anything to break down here? I'll save that for my crafter. I forgot to break down the necklaces with my crafter. Up next, the maid outfit? Yeah, dude. Some real soft peach skin and cat ears. I'd probably feel nice. I'd probably feel real nice. The maid outfit? I mean, what kind of maid outfit are we talking? Because I feel like there's male maids, right? Remind me to skip that stream? Nah, bro. I'm going to catfish you right into that stream, bro. It's gonna, the title is going to be Slog Returns to World of Warcraft with a better guild. That's going to be the title of the stream. And then you're going to come in, and I'm going to be in a maid dress with cat ears on. I know how to get you in here, bro. I know how to get you here. <laughs> they have a whole black market for pets because the population is so big. Reach the beach they have to supplement their food. The old college. I could kind of believe that. But it also sounds like that would be something that I'd hear on Fox News. I'm sure there's a black market. I don't know if it's because they have to have a black market for their population, though. I could be wrong, though. I don't research China's food intake very often. Wait. Made cafe stream, 500k chat points. There you go, dude. That's how I'll reach... Uh... What's the next one after affiliate? Partner? But then I'll have to do every stream in a maid dress. I could get behind that, though. All right. We found the right master. Right master Lachesis. Coming with me, right master? They closed it during COVID because that is where uh, they thought COVID came from. Yeah, I know they have, like, the, the live animal markets and stuff, right? I guess I just don't picture as, that as being black market, but I, I'm sure it's unregulated. I guess if it's unregulated, then it's a black market. I'm being serious, though. I should customize the redeems just a little when you get time. Yeah, dude, if you got it, or I, I should, like, give them, what, different images or something? Before we charge into certain danger, like different you need icons to know or what? something isn't right. I remember defeating Katora, but somehow the creature and its cabal have returned. And the pearl. I have a vague memory of moving it myself. Oh shit. I am unsettled. This right master, man, he gave he gave the fucking pearl. He's under mind control. Why would you move the pearl and not tell anyone, bro? Right master. The fuck. That's the just fuck, it. Bro. The vague memory. It feels as though it belongs to someone else. Forgive me. We can worry about that later. Now, we need to find the Abyssal Pearl and cut off its connection to Arteum. Only then can we stop the flow of Yabra. <laughs> yeah. uh, the chat redeem, not the emotes. Let me see what you mean by that. Oh, okay. Like, with the points. How would I customize them though? Just put a give them a different image? Is that what you mean? He said no clitora? You don't want to follow someone who tells you no clitora. That's bad advice to take. You already know my issues with your emotes. They're not orcs, but I already know why that is. Yeah, because I'm cheap. I just went for something green. Thought he said clitora. Oh, then you definitely want to go with that. Then you definitely want to go with that. Then that's great advice. That's great advice, then. 
Very I mean, good. if you guys got any images for, or destroyed. any ideas for custom we need to images, search let the me know. And make sure none of the creatures breached the defenses. I tried to examine the area through the scrying pool, but something blocked my efforts. Are you ready to proceed? Make them different, better, like we can all brainstorm ideas for redeems. Definitely keep people watching sometimes. Yeah. I mean, I could be super, uh, I'd be super full of myself and just make a lot more of these kind. It's a lot more of my faces. <laughs> that, that was free. These ones were free for me to make. No, I know what you're saying. I know that you're saying not the emotes, but using the channel points. But put the images on it. Or are you saying have like different text, like different shit? I couldn't think, like, I literally couldn't think of anything to fucking put. I was like, well, what the fuck are people gonna wanna redeem? One day I thought, okay, I'll put burp on there because I can burp on demand. And I'm sure people, I'm sure some assholes will make me wanna burp. And then the ban in game option, the compliment me, choose what I play. Yeah, everything else is pretty much just is as it is. Meow. Yeah. I could put, uh, I could put, um, I could put meow. We could put a meow emote. But that's all on YouTube. All, all my cat fans, uh, all my cat fans are on YouTube and they can't even redeem the chat. You can't even redeem the chat. So I think I told you guys about the girl I used to know that could uh, burp from her other end on demand. But not the back end, the front end. She could, uh, with that, she could make it burp. <laughs> Eat bird and plugs feathers. Yeah, I could put a, a good a chat redeem for eating a bird live on stream. I could channel my... Um, What's that dude? Ozzy Osbourne? Just start eating birds live on stream. Okay, I'm ready, right, Master? I'm also learning how to play the harmonica. So I was thinking about putting a chat redeem for me to play the harmonica just to like make sure everybody leaves my stream as soon as possible. I'm teaching myself how to play Piano Man with the harmonica. And by teaching myself how to play I mean, I'm making noises with the harmonica that kind of resemble Piano Man. But we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay. I wasn't paying attention because I was thinking about burping and chatty emotes and eating birds. But I imagine I want to follow my quest marker. Yeah, it's too bad YouTube doesn't have more features that I could plug a bunch of like community shit in there. That's the one thing I'll say about the YouTube stream is there's a lot less like fun shit for YouTube to be able to do while they're watching. I think that's where Twitch has them beat. I think that's where Twitch is a better service. Better for community engagement. There's the pearl. Destroy it and close that portal. I'm actually surprised they haven't come up with more shit. Facts, meow. Meow facts. The meowiest of facts. Like, I don't even... Oh, there's a pearl. I see it. Let's just nuke these guys real quick. I should switch to my double-handed so I actually learn what this class does. Alright, that's gold. That's vendor trash. I'll sell vendor trash. Let's keep the harmonica in the drawer for now. No promises. No promises. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's that big guy. Call down our banner. Okay, we're gonna hit him with this. Then we're gonna get stun locked, it looks like. Give him a Venom Claw. Then I'll do that. And then I'll do whatever this is. Oh, and we killed him. Okay. We're dangerous, huh? We did it. Save it for a rainy day. Yeah. You should get one of those harmonica holders that go around your neck and hold the harmonica in front of your mouth. And have that as a redeem, but then like never play it. Just have now it there. Let's go check on the vaults. Just keep everybody on the edge of their seats. 
have it for like three years. Every single stream, just have the harmonica chilling here, but literally never play it and just like hype up that like, guys, one of these days, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna play you guys a song of your life and just stream people along for like three or four years. And then when I finally play it, I'll play like Old McDonald How to Farm. I think that might be OP. I think that might be the way, bro. I kind of like that idea. No, you have to talk and breathe out of it. Okay, so me and my son, Maddie, we have two harmonicas. He has a harmonica and I have a harmonica. And we actually talk to each other with harmonicas and we call it harmonica language, okay? It's harmonica language. You place a harmonica in your mouth and then you say things like, harmonica language. And then we'll try to guess what each other's saying. Like, I love you, or you smell like farts. So, like, we got a pretty... I'm pretty good at harmonica language, bro. Like, I'm not trying to toot my own horn here, but, like, I'm a pretty damn good harmonica talker. Harmonica player, not so much. But I can... Harmonica language! So I got that going on for me. It's hard to think of redeems that aren't jokes at your expense. I mean, that's fine. I'm fine with some of that, dude. I'm fine with, like... I was a fat kid, bro, and I'm still kind of fat. So, like, I don't even fucking... I'm fine with self-depreciation. I don't know if you know it's my stream or not, but I tend to, like, self-depreciate quite often, this way. and All it right. doesn't really bother me. It just depends on, like, how much of an expense, right? Like, how, like... How much of a dick are we going to be to Slognarn? That's a real thing. But I think I'd be good at the harmonica because I'm actually like a pretty good fucking whistler. I'm a pretty good whistler. So between my lips and my tongue, I think I can fucking, I can slide that shit all over the harmonica. I can get that shit done, bro. I can get that shit done, dude. Mm -hmm. I'm learning tongue blocking where you block. You, you block the harmonica with your tongue. Make the little penis tip with your tongue. Pretty good at it, dog. Right, Master Lachesis. These ancient vaults house relics of great power and unusual nature. I agree. I I I've seen what the tongue can do. Yes, Katora is it's here. True. Be on your guard, friend of Valserin. Who you redeemed definitely at the top of my list. All you got, you got to look at the camera and curl your hands like a cat. I think I have a ooh ooh sound alert, don't I? Didn't we put something like that in, Terp? We can definitely do that as a redeem, though. What do you mean, curl your hands like a cat? I don't even know what that means. I'm not familiar with that expression. What kind of sound alerts do I have in here? We haven't heard this one for a minute. I don't like them putting chemicals in the water that turn the friggin' frogs gay! Do you understand that? Turn, turn the, the friggin', friggin frogs, frogs gay! Serious crap! <laughs> we got that one. That's not quite uwu though. There we go. Yeah, we got a uwu. We got a uwu. 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 You didn't add grab his dick and twist. No, I didn't have time to do any of that yet. Was is this how a cat? Is this what you mean? Uwu. Is that how it? I don't understand. I don't know what it is. I'm not anime enough, but I'd be willing to like... Oh, you sent it in Discord? Okay, let me see. Oh, like... Like that? Like I'm about to hop? <laughs> I think I'm getting pretty close to it. I'll work on it in the mirror. I'll work on it in the mirror. We'll see how it goes. I like how it's right below uh, my hand penis that is in the Discord. Yeah, now we're getting somewhere, right? I'm a little disappointed that nobody liked my hand penis that I posted in, into Discord. You're not getting a second hand embarrassment. You're not. Yeah, 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 absolutely. That's true. I'll bring my wife in and I'll have my kids there to judge me, too. I'll have her record it, too, and then send it to my family members. That way we know that the embarrassment is coming through strong. You think K Tora is here? The sea sloat or one of its agents. I have a strange feeling, so be on your guard. I have a strange feeling I'm going to have to kill this fool. I think he's bad news. I think he's corrupted. 
I think he's actually super fucking duper corrupted. Super duper corrupted. I did add a lot of sound alerts though. I did that for you guys, but I haven't added the, the dick twisty one. I haven't added that one yet. Well, I'll get on that one for sure. Oh God, I can only imagine your wife walking in on you practicing it. I can too, and it would be great. She's like, you're done with Twitch. Nope. Done. Nope. Her biggest fear is me uh, becoming homosexual for some reason. I don't know. I don't know why that is. I don't know if it's... Uh, I don't know if it's because of all the homosexual jokes I make all the time or the fact that I'm always talking about doing gay things with my friends. But like, she always thinks, always thinks I'm going to be gay for some reason. Yeah, that's what I'll tell her. You turn me gay. I was a straight... I was straight as an arrow before I met you. These 16 years. <laughs> turning me gayer every month. Is there a particular relic at the sea that the sea slowed seeks? I swear this game's whole purpose is to make me sound like I can't fucking read. Everything's a tongue twister or just a bunch of gibberish words. I can think of a number of likely candidates, including a few relics we believe originated in the ancient sea slowed kingdom of Ulverkus. Let's Ulverkus. get to the central rotunda and begin our search there. Oh, I lead the way, asshat. I know Wolf could never handle any of my advances when we play World of Warcraft. They sealed the chamber. We'll need to go through them. We'll go right through them. We'll go right through these bad boys. What does this do? If I see on fire. this place, mortal flea! Okay, that's burning that guy. What's this four do? Okay, four was my cleave. That's right. That's my cleave class. Um, probably want to kill this lady. Do that. We'll do whatever this does. I don't know what any of my skills do. I'll just keep putting a bunch of venom on her. The barrier of webs. <laughs> Burn it away so we can enter the rotunda. Uh, anything else good in here? Where's the good shit? Where's the good shit? I'll take that. What you got in the sack? Some conberry? I'll take that. You got some lemons? Yeah, I'll make some nice tea. I haven't met me in a D and D sesh when my teacher isn't the DMD and my intelligence above eight. I can put the moves on. There you go, bro. There you go. You and toxic with your ER ERP. Those were that was some of the best ERP I've ever had in my life, dude. That shit was on point. That shit was, and that was like wholesome. That was like wholesome ERP, right? That was that was like good stuff. We pop our tent up. We pop up the tent. We'd welcome Another everybody into our ERP intrusion. session. My apologies. Yeah, we saw this guy like our earlier in the quest. Defenses delayed my arrival. Mafala's webs? Oh, I hate those things. Allow me. Yeah, that guy like showed up on a random rock when we were going to the sinkhole. You guys remember that? Oh, that was bright. Damn it. You found me again. I'll return when I can. A champion of Meridia? Tea for lemons? Yeah, lemon tea, helpful. tea for lemons. And a tomato, tomato, bro. Tomatoes, tomatoes. Tomatoes for tomatoes. You know. Ketchup for tomatoes. Tomatoes for ketchup. It's all the same shit. Wholesome ERP? Oh god, yeah. Right, Terp? We kept that we kept that shit super wholesome. The fucking tents? Dude, the whole reason I became a clother was just so I could build ERP tents. And then I gave them out to the whole guild. I made ERP tents for everybody. <coughs> uh oh, we got this slow. I killed you. I remember our battle as clear as day. You remember yep, exactly ERP. Wow. what yeah, I want you to remember. How long is the stream going to be for this? I'm not sure. Orbs of Brock and Drell, uh -oh. your deepest memories will be mine. Backworm, this does not concern the likes of you. Out here, quickly. We need to hurry if we're going to help the right master. Okay, we're not gonna help him now. We're just gonna leave him here. I think it's pretty gnarly looking. I think this stream will probably be like three hours, something like that. Uh, I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. I have a pain management doctor appointment for uh, all the various pains I have because I'm old. 
So I'm not going into work tomorrow. But the appointment's at 8 a.m. So let's get stay up a little later tonight. I'm gonna go do some da some dailies, finish them off for the night. We'll return eventually. Sounds good, buddy. It's a good thing I followed you after I alerted the rest of the Conclave. I think I can counteract Katora's mind magic, but I'll need your help. What's happening to the Right Master? Katora is using the power of the Orbs of Barakandrel to enhance his mind magic and lock the Right Master in a mental grip. Okay. From what I can discern, the Sea Slot is flipping through his memories as you or I would turn the pages of a book. Oh my god. How fucking amazing of her to think that I read books. I'm fucking Shrek. What are the orbs? What are the orbs of Barak and Drell? An ancient implement. Three matched orbs that our relic master believes originated in the Sea of Pearls. We long suspected they were connected to the Sea Slode. Katora thinks the power of the relic will keep us from interfering. But I have an idea. You know, Terp, I've been really impressed with your restraint that you've had during the stream about not commenting pearl necklace every five minutes. I'm, I feel like you might be growing up, bro. So what do you need me to do? Take this ward key. It will disable the protections on the repositories so you can locate the Ulvor staff and bring it oh, to okay. me. Oh, okay. I can it. use the staff to breach the barrier and aid the right master. Just watch out for any lingering Yagra. Okay, I'm not too worried about the Yagras. I'll find the Ulver staff. I'll find your Ulvery staff. Oh, there's a lingering Yagra. He's lingering, all right. He's a lingering. Yo, we kind of clapped that fool. Um, I think I need to keep medium hands. I think that's what it was telling me in like the guide I looked up. That I want to use medium hands. I want to put those heavy hands on them, you know, just give them that medium hands. Give them the old medium medium. Give them that old medium medium. Yeah, that's, that's actually working. We're actually doing things with My favorite part about the two-handed build is my little lunge ability I get. The lunge ability just feels so good. So I think how we probably want to play this is put poison on him. I feel like that cleave does good damage too, but maybe hit him with the whip. Yeah, dude, we just created for 15. That guy did not survive. He had a bad time. Oh, what's in the backpack? Intricate? Okay, that's good. And an apple. I like apples. Meow. Meow my meow all day. Ember's meowing it up for me. She's been a little quiet. Ember's been a little quiet this time. But she appreciates your meows. It helps encourage her. Helps keeps her like really encouraged. Time to bring the lightning! Oh no, she's talking right now. She's bringing the lightning. Do you hear that? She's trying to show off for you guys. Show off. Yo, I just got smacked. That poison's actually doing work, though. And yeah, we got some corn. Fuck yeah, we do. Fuck yeah, we do. I feel like I just need to go down here, right? Let's take a shortcut. Yeah, she is. Big time. Yeah, we'll take a little shortcut. I might have missed him. I am as patient and enduring as the sea, worm. I might have taken now the opposite of a reveal the hiding place. Find the staff. I guess I didn't find the staff. I need to go this way. Okay. Okay, my bad. Your mind is oh, my mind, Aikisus. Take care of these little weirdos. Reveal wieners. your memories to me. Take care of these fucks. Oof. I'm gonna drop a flag. I'm gonna hit him with some poison. And I'm gonna hit him with my three ability, which does something. And then we'll whip him. That works. I'm gonna go to sleep. Meow. All right. Well, you have a good night. I appreciate you stopping in for the stream as always, Ethan. Thank you. Thank you. Hope you have a good night. I hope you dream of 
yarn and eating birds. But I think you were the decent one who would pick their feathers. So hopefully that goes well for you. Hopefully that all goes just the way you want. But I do appreciate you stopping in. So thank you, my man. I was trying to think of like a feline version of a man, but I'm pretty sure that's still just a feline. So I couldn't think of anything clever to say. So I'm just, I'm ousting myself. Holy shit, my inventory is full. That's new. That's new. When was the last time that fucking happened? The hell? What the hell, homeboy? What the hell, homeboy? Why would that be the case? I guess I gotta go sell some shit. Meow, no thank you, All right? Okay, let's get rid of this pie. I don't need this pie. Drop the pie. Destroy the pie. Get rid of the pie. Okay, I guess I'll just use the pie. I guess I'm eating some pie. I guess that's all you can do with the pie. Is it out of my inventory? No. Get out of my inventory. Just because I have 37 here? Get out of my inventory. Because I'm in quick slots. That's why. Yeah, I'm going to need to go sell some shit. I'm going to need to go sell some shit. Well, we did find the suppository relic. So we know what we'll do with that. Meow, indeed. Indeed. Who's in here? Was he alive? Yo. I was expecting somebody to actually be alive here. That's creepy. My donkey didn't like it one bit either. I think we go back. Maybe this way. We gotta talk to Valsirian. Can I get back in here? Nope. I think we gotta backtrack. I think we gotta backtrack. So again, I jumped down here for absolutely no reason. Like an expert. Facts. Straight facts. I think I was here. Especially strong lately. No. I like it. This good old fashioned backtrack. Where you at? Where you at? I got your staff, bro. Well, that was a big jump. That was a big old jump. The Sigic Relic Vault. Where you at, bro? We just leaving this guy in this whole place? Oh no. Okay. Oh, and it's, it's a chance. We're chain. running out of time. Whatever the sea sloat searches for in the right master's mind, I believe it is close to finding it. Have you brought me the Ulvor staff? I found the Ulvor staff. Excellent. And it appears to be in perfect condition. With the staff. I'm certain I can pierce the barrier and open a path to the Mindscape where the Right Master struggles against Katora. So we're going to enter the Right Master's mind? Not we. You. Oh, shit. I need to remain here to anchor you to the physical world. And you're going into Katora's mind. We'll use the connection between them to put it's not you too where creepy you in there, you know? actually hurt the sea slowed within its own Mindscape. How can I hurt Katora in the Mindscape? Katora's Mindscape is the perfect place to hurt the Sea Slowed. It's where he's most vulnerable. Oh, it's like in kicking someone in the nuts. All right. become reality, you'll be able to stop Katora once and for all. Now touch the staff and go save the Let's right touch it, master. Bro. Let's touch it. Someone tells me to touch it, I'm going to touch it, you know? I'm ready. Let me touch it. Let me touch it and get right into his mind. Touch the Ulvor staff. Keep hearing and enter the mindscape. You're hearing what you want to hear. You're hearing what you want to hear. I am going to school. To, oh, to school? Oh, have a good day at school, Georgiana. Make sure you pay attention, retain knowledge, better yourself as a human. Do all the things you're supposed to do at school. But thanks for stopping in before you go to school. I appreciate that. I hope you have a good day. This place is very blue and kind of pretty. That's probably right. Yeah, selective hearing. Yeah, exactly. So you're you're choosing to hear Clitora. Yo, okay. You know what? 
I kind of forgot we went into someone's brain. I was like, hey, that kind of looks like neurosynapses. This looks like this could be some kind of <laughs> neural network. And I was like, oh, that's right. We're in somebody's mind. We're in somebody's brain. That makes sense. Okay, before we go explore this guy's brain, I'm going to go fill up my tea. I'll be back in a couple minutes. So whoever wants to keep hanging out, great. If not, I'll see you guys in five minutes. Yeah, we back at it. We are back at it. Who's ready? Who be ready for more? We gotta, uh, we gotta figure out what's going on with this big ass slowed, bro. I also got a cookie, so I don't go anywhere without getting a cookie. That's good stuff. I know I have a good background remover or background sound remover, because this is a super crunchy cookie. Not even picking it up. And then, see if I turn this off. Come on now. It's spiking, but not too much. Not too much. Yeah, I did mod you. You should be mod now. Or I'm, I modded um, Mantis fucking Toboggan. The only one that didn't have a picture of um, fucking, oh my God, how am I forgetting his name? The only one that didn't have a picture of fucking, uh, oh my God, this killed me. How am I not fucking being able to pick up his name right now? Danny DeVito. Yeah, Danny DeVito. I was like, dude, how can I not remember fucking Danny DeVito's name? Okay. We're inside of somebody's brain right now. We're inside of somebody's mind with a cat and an ass. And an ogre. An orc, but, you know. You dare enter my domain, what? Vanquish the Guardians to reveal oh, each shit. protected memory. You'll weaken Katora and learn something at the same time. Oh. A Vergen, what's this thing? A Vergrang, a Vergrangu? That's a weird name. Let's put some poison damage on him. Does this put burn on him? Can't tell if that puts burn on him or not. Ember is really the heavy lifter here. It's a bargain. The island for the so heart doesn't let me do anything. I have you set as a highest mod. Yes, yes, just as we agreed. But only a portion of the crystal. We don't want to alert the Sapiarchs too soon. You should be do able to do Tell everything Tell your on fellow there. princes all will be well. The right master is no match for my mind magic. So Nocturnal has assured me. Don't disappoint us, Katora. It was literally the only Mantis Toboggan that didn't have... Um... An icon on it. Let me see here. Yeah, and I don't think it's shit I can mess with while I'm streaming. But I definitely made you a mod, bro. I definitely made you a mod. But moderation activity will be shown. Community moderation. Maybe I can do it. Mantis Toboggan. T O B O G G A N. Then if I try to add another Mantis Toboggan, I'm setting you as a managing moderator, not even just like a moderator. There's another Mantis Toboggan without an image, but it says YTPS at the end. So that's, that can't be you. But it is a different icon. It's orange on this one. But I know yours is uh, purple. To...
Fucking. And well, now I found more. There might be more, dude. Now there's one that's blue. But I don't want to just give all these random mantis toboggans fucking mod privileges. Yeah, I have it set up as two words. There's one, two, three, four, five people that show up for mantis toboggan. Two of them don't have icons. Here, let me try this one. We'll see. Save. Okay, I gave another mantis toboggan with a different icon. Mod privileges. So tell me if you can do anything. If not, I'm going to get rid of that person's one. A slowed risen stalker. I looked it up, and that's all I said I needed to do, so... A little poison on this fool, too. Big swing. Big swing. Yeah, that nine gold. Yeah, that nine gold, homies. I like this big cleave. That works. I lured you here for one purpose, worm. Hey, money is different on YouTube, probably. It says... So, for that shit... It says... Oh, I know, that was down here. What did I do slash mod? Yeah, nothing really shows up. It might be different. Let's see. Take a look. Um. Yeah, it says you should, as a managing moderator, the user has the same capabilities as a standard moderator, but in addition, they can manage blocked words and change chat modes in live. The user can, as for a standard, standard moderator, the user can remove comments, which will appear in your held for review page. It can also moderate your live chat messages. So, like, in the chat, click on the name. Oh, I could just click on your name to add you as a moderator. Hold on. Add as a moderator. Managing moderator and a, I'm going to make you manage, managing moderator. Let's see. Let me get rid of your other names. I didn't actually realize I could do that. Remove as a managing moderator. Add as a man managing moderator. Mantis Toboggan is now managing moderator of your channel. Now click on, um, you probably can't like report my name, but now if you click on a name, shows channel activity, go to channel, pin message, report, remove, put user in timeout, hide user on this channel. So, should be able to do some shit now. Should be able to do some shit. Okay, work. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got the icon. Perfect. You got a little wrenchy boy. You got a little wrenchy boy icon. You're official now, bro. I need to add awkward weeb too, but I need to add the old awkward weeb. Okay. Okay. Let's go see what's going on in this guy's brain. Also, your chat is gone. Yeah, I just erased it. I refreshed it. So that I didn't look like a noob with my slash mod chat in there. Because people expect a, you know, pretty high, high standard quality from me, bro, you know? I don't want to disappoint him. Top professional right here. We got dissonance. Oh, it's going to be like a Pixar movie. Okay. Got our Pixar movie going on now. Give him the old poison. Okay, well, let's let him slap me. I still got the poison out on him, though. Ember's Repeat a fucking good. Repeat my words, There are some new pants, too. Tell me what you Healing must done. do. Healing done. That could be useful for me. 
Oh no, my inventory's full. Enter Fart. the crystal tower. Hey, hold on, let me dump I some will. shit out of my inventory. Take the heart of transparent lore. Yes. Yes. Hide it away until I call for you to give it to me. Get rid of this. Not even the princes must know where it is. I got too much shit in here. Hide the heart. Oh, because I did steal some shit. Let's get rid of this moonstone. I guess stuff you steal doesn't go into your crafting bag. One stolen log. Oh, 21 stolen log picks. Yeah, I'm gonna need to get some shit out of here, bro. Problem is, I can't store a lot of this stuff either, which is kind of annoying. I have a bunch of cloudy poison damage, though. That kind of sells for money, too. I drop this fucking defense crate, because I don't even do open world PvP. Festival noisemakers? Well, I mean, I might need that. I might need that. I'll drink some more beer. I think I just need to go... I, I oh, Okay, I got a ton of recipes. I need to go back to the bank after this. We'll drop this. We'll drop this. Yeah, I need to go back to the bank. Do some inventory management. My memory shit. Do some inventory management. Them. This is a cool place, though. Uh oh. Okay. Fuck it. I was gonna put some health on my bar, but... Put some poison on him. Do whatever that does. Hit him with a little whip. He's going underground. We're actually doing good work on him. He's right here. Yeah, these story bosses are way easier than the fucking dungeons, I'll tell you that much. Katora's mind. Way it's easier than the dull. dungeons. I'm taking the right master back to his study. You need to get out of there. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Use the stuff to exit the we gotta get out of his mind before he consumes us with his here. mind. Or it's mindception. Sotha Sil. Okay. A sea slowed. Interesting. I haven't dissected such a specimen in an exceedingly long unit of temporal measurement. He could have just said time. I don't know why he had to say temporal measurement. Where are Valserine and the Right Master? Valserine took the Valserine. Right Master to Kapora Tower to administer to his wounds. Luckily for you, I arrived in time to help Valserin open a path out of the Slode's dying mind. It is lucky. What did you learn before the mindscape collapsed? Katora made a deal with the Daedric Prince and altered the Right Master's memories. Yes, I surmised as much. The triad of Daedric Princes has become bold in its attempts to influence Nern, though influence seems to be the least of their goals. The Slode, however, was unable to harvest whatever memory it sought from the Right Master. Okay, well, Kator wanted to learn where the Right Master hid something called the Heart of the Transparent Law. That revelation disturbs me. Uh oh. I feared the Crystal Tower was too tempting a target for the Daedric Triad. I need to ponder the full implications of their plot. Meanwhile, I suggest you go to Kapora Tower and see how the Kipura. Right Master is faring. Okay. Okay, I'll do that. I'm gonna be brave and I'm gonna sign up for another dungeon and we'll see if I rage quit or not. See if I rage quit or not. Let's first, okay, we gotta get out of here and then we gotta go back to the bank. That's what we have to do. We have to go to a bank. See, when you say it, I hear it. And when they say it, I hear it wrong. <laughs> fair. That's all fair. That's how the game wants to get you, bro. You know, they want you to feel like you're being a weirdo. I'm just gonna spend money and go back to a bank. I know I have a bank around here somewhere. Is there a bank in here somewhere? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna drop the 146. We going for it. I'm gonna drop that load. I ain't even scared. We dropping that load. We going in for it. I ain't even scared, bro. My inventory is full up. A 
crafter is fucking lagging behind on using all my shit. That guy's not looking that impressive. I'll be honest. He looked better with his heavy gear. Well? Okay. Okay, banker. Another visitor? How yep. ex- Okay, withdraw deposit. I have a lot of spaces left in my inventory, so... First thing I want to do... Let's get the blueprints in there. Because that's easy for my crafter to use up. Let's look at the necklaces. Some blue shit. Put these treasure maps. Because I ain't going to use these tre treasure maps. I have a ton of lockpicks. Maybe we'll put a couple lockpicks in there too. I had no idea I had that many lockpicks. Okay. Yeah, a lot of recipes taking up inventory. I'll keep the ones that are worth gold so we can sell some shit here too. Obviously, the ones with like inspiration we'll give out. I think I honestly should just like sell everything else for now. Because my crafter is so far behind. I think that's what we'll do. Can I buy... I think I need inventory space upgrade before I need anything else. Okay. Make another crafter. Yeah, but I already have to grind the one crafter, right? So I'm just like bullshitting my way through that first crafter. But I'd actually have to level that other crafter up. And I don't see myself doing that, dude. I'm trying to be real with myself. I don't see myself doing that. You, My main crafter is only level you fucking... To need direction. Seven. As a justicia of the divine prosecution, I request... No, I want to sell shit. I could make like a mule. I'm not saying I'm a Someone just hold on my shit, but... Perish the thought. Okay. I'm going to sell a bunch of shit. We're at 55,000 gold. Health recovery, I probably could use. This is a lot of damaging po poison. It's like, I am doing a poison build, so I probably do want to hold on to that. But it's taking up a lot of space. I don't think I really need anything for Magicka. I do need a repair, too. That's expensive. And I know I can sell some of this stuff to, like, my guild, but I have no idea what anything is worth. Like, as far as, like, solutions of health and potions and stuff. I'll sell an empty soul gem. I'll sell this tomato garlic. I'll save this for my crafter. We'll sell all this other shit. Well, as soon as I'm done with WoW and Final Fantasy, I'll jump on ESL. That's fair, bro. I'm down with that. We're just going to sell all the shit. We're going to clean up our inventory. 67. Fuck it. Let's go. The City of Ash. I think I've done this one before. I think I've actually messed with this one before. Feeling a little more confident about this one. But I need to put some potions on my shit. Before everybody runs around. All fucking willy nilly. Quick slots. I need... Where'd he go? Uh, no. I don't want that. I just want my potions. Where are my fucking potions? Why does it keep moving? It's like it's loading shit as I'm going. Okay, health. Perfect. Now I need to eat some food. Where's my food at? Consumables. Okay, we'll drink this rum. I should get us for a half hour. Okay, let's go catch up. I just have one more expansion. Damn, dude, you really are burning through that, huh? You really are chugging through that. Okay, I remember this this come. dungeon. This dungeon's pretty easy. Ready. Fire. Oh shit! But then I'm gonna die right here. Oh, that was close. You level 85. Nice, bro. Yeah, follow this guy. Big swamps. Big swampy swamps. Look at this flame archer narch nurch. Yeah, it's going better already. It's already going better. Did 
you have on you, bro. You have on you. Why can't I loot you? Why can't I loot you? Yeah, there we go. Woo! Big swings. Oh, no, no, get out of there. A lot of my stamina. Build that back up. Probably know what my three ability does, but yeah, we'll find out. Okay, all right, we're doing stuff. Yeah, you've been slamming through that game, Turp. I feel like I need more stamina too for a stamina build. I can burn through my magic on this build. And I switch over to this guy for stamina. Yeah, he is. Yeah, right? I've done every quest so far. Nice, dude. Done every quest. Red zero of the quest. Poison on him. Whatever this does. Why does not doing that much? You got poison on. Let me switch to this one. Oh. Little thing on him. I think that makes him weaker. I like made this build, but I didn't actually read how I'm supposed to play him. So that's just how I do things. Switch back over here, get poison back on him. There you go. I assume I want to switch back and forth between those. This one was, might be better. It gives me more max health, but less stamina. We'll take it. We'll check it out. I will just watch another YouTube video. Yep, have no clue on what's going on. No, oh, gotcha. And then you'll be all caught up, huh? Oh, damn, one of these weapons is already busted? Which one? Didn't I just pay to repair everything? Maybe I have to charge it. And what was going on? Okay, yeah, I had to charge it. My guy definitely needs some new drip, though. He's looking wonky. That dude's looking wonk wonk centrals, bro. Direct transmog? I know, I need to find it, dude. Burn it! That big old cleave does work though. Big old cleave does work. damn ultimate so long and then I never end up using him. I think, we can. I think he's dead. Mm, no. I guess I'll just sell that. I guess I'll just sell that. Oh, we got a treasure chest in here. Perfect. A griddle of health. They keep trying to give me health stuff. I need more stamina. That was a good little smackdown. That was a good little smackdown. Fire all over everybody on this thing. Switch to my other weapons. Look at that. All over here. Nope. Oh, I keep getting blocked by the fucking stuff. 
environmental shit and I can't do my charge. Oh, because I didn't switch to the right class. That makes sense. That makes a little more sense. Makes a bit more sense. We're definitely going better though. Doing the poison. I'm gonna switch to my other class. Put this out. Put that on him. I think that does something. I think it makes him weaker. And when I run out of poison, I'll switch back. Spell gloves, max magicka. No. Switch to this class, my two-handed class, as I'm going to the battle, then I'll use my charge to go in. I will harvest so we'll charge him like that. For the and we'll hit him with the poison. And then this fire thing, whatever the fuck that does. Then we'll switch, hold down my banner. And put out this circle that makes him weaker. Okay, so now I think I got two debuffs on him. A lot of fire. I'm gonna fall back. And I'm gonna throw rocks at him. Throw rocks at him. Okay, now his poison's coming off. We're gonna charge in. Hit him with another poison. Hit him with some flames. Oh, I got stunned again. Piss him off. Okay, switch to my other class. There's a little thing down here that does something. At one point, I'll read. I don't feel like I'm at the point where I want to read yet. That seemed to work. That seems to work. It was that other, that other dungeon fucking sucked, though. One with actual mechanics. That was rubberish. Rubbish? Rubberish? Rubbish? Ooh. Almost dirt. I almost dirt there. I almost dirt there. Rubberish. It's rubberish. That's the next level of rubbish. You have rubbish, and then it becomes rubberish. That's how much rubbish it is. Pretty big deal. And yeah, that big cleave did work. I'm out of stamina. Switch to this class. Free some fire. Yeah, that worked. I'm alright with that. Oh, there's more. That there. That actually did stuff too. Might actually be playing this class right. Uh oh. There's another one. I didn't even see this one. I didn't see this one. Wind up. We got him. I'll have to get a DPS meter at some point, I think. So these sun flame bracers are better. Reduce the cost of block, which doesn't really help me. But they are better. Equip those. Oh, I can't use I can't swap during combat. I always forget I can't switch during combat. I wish I could switch during combat. Bunch of rubberish, bro. You know what I mean? You know what kind of rubberish I'm talking about, dog? I really like that big AOE swing. Definitely like that. For Lord Dagon. Okay, we're gonna get his poison. We're gonna switch to this glass. Use that. We're gonna call down our banner. There was some fire. There was whatever the hell that is. We're doing stuff. She's right there. Throw some rocks at her. That's the thing to do. So we're back out. Okay, we need to go back in for the poison. There we go. There we go. Perfect. I just get two of the same things. I just got two of the same exact drops. Super cool. Love to see it. Love to get the same fucking drop two times in a row. It's awesome. We got the final boss coming up. The final boost lay. Look at the way this person runs. My god. What a dork. 
Your hide will make a wonderful rug for the master. Surrender and I'll Ace would make a you wonderful quickly. rug for the master. Jerk. Rise, press minions. This, press this. I don't know what I'm doing. Press that. Looks like my poison is the only debuff. I will really go out on him. Well, let me switch back to this guy. I want to keep that poison stack. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, man, he went far away. Get the charge out. Hit him with some more poison. Hit him with some big swings. That actually worked. A little whip. A little whip action. Rise, minions. I don't feel like the whip does that much. Stop and more than my normal attack, late. I guess. A little more poison on him. Target is immune. Oh, these guys? Oh, the dude's over here. You had me lost. Yeah, we got him. Activity complete. GG, everybody. The Glorious Anniversary Jubilee Gift Box. Okay, that's cool. That sounds fancy. Sounds pretty fancy. What is in there? Okay, so these were... I got the Sunderflame Bracers, 309. And then I had the Burning... What was it? Oh, these Sunder... For, what are the different? Reduce... Reduce the cost of block or increase critical resistance. Okay, so I probably want this one. That seems better. And this caress. No, because it's heavy and I want to focus on stamina. It's also heavy. That's the one we didn't want. Okay. GG. The GG's. It's ESO's 10th anniversary event. Oh, is that what's going on? Okay. Like I say, I play games, but I don't pay attention to anything going on around it. Style page, Earthbone Alien Jerkins. Yeah, jerk me. Jubilee Confetti Pack. Die, yeah, okay, cool. Decorations. Cool. This game's only been out for 10 years? I could have swore this game's been out longer than 10 years. I could have sworn. And then, check my mail, because I should have gotten a thing for completing that. Ha, I knew you missed me. Seems longer, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, dude. I'll take that. There we go. That was the thing I was looking for. What we got here? Shoulders, medium. This might be better. No. It could be better if I had more of the armor set. Let's open up all our crap. Open up all our crap. More Jubilee box. These, no. So much shit. Okay, damn it. Where did it all go? Burning longer. Anniversary Jubilee gift box. I got some rosin, a blueprint for a high island trunk, and some sand and maple for the battle master reward. Stay out style page, fanged war axe, a shield that I won't use, whatever the hell that is, and another transmute. Whatever hell that is. Give me that. I'll use that too. Yep. Yep, you can give it over here. I'll take it. I'll take it. Just don't clog up my inventory. Style pages. I've already unlocked the style. I wonder if I could sell this then. Probably not. Oh, the gestures? I think everybody has the gesture one. Yo, yo, yo. Welcome on back. How was your grinding? How was your lovely grinding experience? And penis. Is it through the penis? No, it's through this. Leave group. Exactly. Leave instance. Exactly.
was not lovely at all, but you uh, but you win and you lose. That's true. That's true. I know all about that second part, bro. I know all about the second part of that equation. Like, no problem. I know about that. Okay, we're back. We're back and we're ready. I would like to also maybe let's do one more dungeon and get a blue thing out of it. I don't know what the blue thing does for me. But we'll try that. Let's see if I can also find a pack merchant. So I want to see how much it would cost. Two. You know what I should do with my ESO gold coin things? Is... So I have 1,700 endeavors. Daily endeavor, craft four items. Capture one resource. Craft one Shamir's rebuke. I don't know what that is. Loot two treasure chests. I just need to find some more fucking treasure chests. What I was going to say is... Not crown crates. Might buy... These mounts. That give me more inventory. I got the donkey. I have 2,600 credits. But I think you get this mount. I might have to get... I'm. Should I get the boar mount? We'll decline that. Should we get the boar mount or the mournhold pack rat? Unfortunately, I was MVP for all of them. There you go. Pack rat? That's what I was thinking, too. I'm not going to let him replace my ass, though. That's five inventory slots account wide, too. And you know what? I'm just going to get this, too. We're buying both of them. There you go. Investment done. Investment. But, my, but I got to keep my ass. My ass is an OG. My ass got to come with me. That's got to be there with me, bro. Uh, let's go talk to Right Master Ikachis. I don't remember where that was. I need to go back up to this waypoint. The Ikachis. Ikachis? That's kind of sexy. I like that. Okay, where is the Ikachis? Journal. Show on map. Helpful. Wait, I need to go to Arteum. Take me there. Take me to Arteum. It would be perfect if you had a Shrek transmog with the donkey. Dude, it would be so great. I'm slowly unlocking more styles, but it's not going to be anytime soon. Oh, there's a merchant right here. I just sold to this guy. Before I was a member, I think I have more shit to sell. Oh, he won't buy a lot of stuff, huh? Buy my simple bait. Oh no, sell. I bought simple bait right there. Duh. Browsing for a new mobile game. What are you looking for, dude? What kind of mobile game are you trying to get into, bro? What kind of filthy mobile game are you trying to get into? All right, we shall go talk to Right Master. Hello, Right Master. Where are you? Where are you, beautiful man, Right Master? As you wish, Right Master. Marvel Strike Force. I had looked at that one, bro. And I'll send word to the Eye of the Queen. Okay, so this guy was getting kind of mind-controlled. I owe you a debt of gratitude, friend of Valserin. Yeah, you do. What the two of you did to help me... Hey, good night, brother. Have a good one, a dude. a step beyond. Thank you. And it seems you accomplished what I failed to Have do. Have a good night, Terp Terp. You ended the threat of Katora. Oh, that's right. We're doing a dungeon. Yeah, let's go. Let's get into it. Let's get wild. Didn't seem to go. Katora tricked me. Let me click through this real quick. You helped me. Normally, I try to read the quest, Perhaps but perhaps the sigil. My, I know my progress no. is going to start over if this dungeon pops. The sapi. The sapiox. Okay. I just want to get through so we can at least get through that part of the quest. Because whenever the dungeon pops and I end up popping into one, then I have to redo like a whole section of the quest. 
I also need to spend my champion points. I think I have quite a few bit of champion points that I haven't messed with, like, at all. The Spindle Clutch 2. Boobs. Nice. Spider boobs. Very nice. Maybe War Robots? I've never heard of War Robots, dude. I ain't never heard of near War Robots. Hey, okay, hopefully these guys carry me through, because I have no idea what I'm doing in here. Got a recipe for chicken breast right off the bat. That's a good sign. I don't have this quest either, so I'll piss him off by picking it up. You there. Piss him off, I tell you. What's going on? Okay, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Thanks, bro. Now you die. Now you die. Fight it up. Now you all die. Do my big boy swing. I feel like my big boy swing is kind of carrying it. I don't like my big boy swing. Although I'm really low on stamina now. Switch over to my fire breath. Yeah, that feels good too. Oh, go back. Go back and throw some rocks. That's the move, bro. Every time. Every time. Well, there's a lot going on here. Come on, charge. Why are you charging? Sometimes my charge attack doesn't work. Maybe I'm just not close enough. Maybe I didn't have enough stamina. Death to the living. I don't have enough stamina. Death to the living. I need to have faster stamina recovery, which this would do, but it's heavy. And I don't think I want to use heavy. Ornate? Yep. I guess I could put like more stamina potions Nobody out there. The that works. We'll come up and smack people from behind. Smack them all from behind. There we go. Yeah, I don't think I've ever done this dungeon before. Over there, it's Mareel. It's Mareel. Sudarim, I thought you were dead. They came in the night, overwhelmed oh, us. Oh, I'm ready. Who did this? Where's Atavar? I, I don't know. Let's dance for Atavar the good people. And Falor ran there for we go. When now we're playing an MMO. Atavar. Now we're playing an MMO. Where you gotta be dancing. Where are you? Holy divines. Look at All right, I wasn't expecting that. that thing. I'm gonna that. Let's go leap at him. I'm gonna drop down my banner of chaos. Put some poison on him. Still don't know what my three ability does, but I'm gonna press it. Seems like the thing to do. I get out of that. I need to be more zoomed back so I can actually see what's happening. We'll put another poison on him. Let me try this too. Let's put this three ability down. Because I think that does something. I really don't really know. First the blood feed, now a guard. Robe of prayer. I don't imagine that's gonna be useful that for me. It. I'll take all Vampires. this other crap. Vampires. You think they know? I'll take all that other good stuff. If not. Oh, yep, you smacked me. You showed me. Are you gonna come at me with that? Die. I don't think so, bro. You're a big swing. Yo, that big swing is fucking what's up. Uses a lot of stamina. But it's what's up. It does work. You've escaped. Yes, Braxton. The Whisperer is gone. No! You can't be real. I, I was going to rescue you. And then I heard her voice. It's over, Braxton. You can rest now. Boss. I don't think he's Yo, listening. Yo, Poops, welcome in, brother. How you doing, You're man? Illusions. I won't let you stop us. Dude, you're thinking Why about trying Honkai? Ever easy. Join my nightmare. I got a sponsorship offer to do Honkai Star Rail. Do you see? To try like play Honkai and try to get people to sign up for it. Uh, but I don't think I'm going to do that. <laughs> it's like one of those deals that they give pretty much to anybody. But it's like, no, if you get this many so people long. to sign up, you can get like $1,000 or $1,500. I was like, yeah, no, I ain't gonna do that. I ain't gonna do that. Yeah, I can't see what's going on. We got a poison. I don't want you just to has see a ton it. of health or what? Get out of here. We gotta kill these guys. There's a lot of people back here. Try thinning the... I feel like we gotta take care of these ads. Get my fire breath out. Fire breath. No. 
I feel like it doesn't switch as seamlessly as I want, but I might just be stupid. Might just be dumb. Okay, yeah, I figured we had to take care of these ads. I won't be. I'll take care of this. What you been up to, Mr. Poops? What are getting going on, bro? Going on in the life of poop. I'm fucking out of mana super quick. Well, at least we got a poison on him. And I'm out of stamina now, too. I'm completely drained. I have to do my big hits. Okay, we'll put the poison buff back on him. Smack him with the one ability. Oh, yep. gotta get away from people. I assume I didn't want to get that on other people. Well, that almost fucking killed me, yo. That almost fucking killed me. It looks like my three ability just shoots out fire. I am struggling with resources, though. I feel like I'm getting drained. I really felt like I was getting... What the fuck just got me? What was that? My necklace is low, considering getting a new one at a guild store or running a dungeon. Each time you die, an equipment loses 10% durability. Okay. I don't know what just killed Did me, though. Hear that? What kind of trouble we getting into? There's someone alive over here. Help me get I'm not sure how I died right there. Open. How low is my necklace? Valor, Pretty low. Can you hear me? Boss, Pretty low. They have at I know, right? Don't Awkward. Awkward. Little big swings though. Do what I can. Swinging big and that's all I got. Let me get out of this red. Do some fire too. No. I swear half the time I click to switch a class, I feel like I'm I might just be misclicking. But I feel like it doesn't register. Maybe it's just the global cooldown in this game. But it feels bad sometimes. Don't let them reach Lord Winterborn! Round him up, round him up, round him up. I want to smack a bunch of them. No, that's as round up as we're getting. Okay. Let me just use all of my fucking stamina. Watch over here, breathe some fire. What's up, man? You got any more Garfield movies coming out or what? Bro got hit with despair? Big time. Big time despair. Biggest, biggest level of despair yet. Oh, this guy's getting fucked up over here. I'm gonna go back him up. Oh, it's Ember. My girl Ember's getting fucked up. Ember, you gotta be more self-sufficient. Fire out. I think that's the end of that. Oh, that's right here. I press escape. That's perfect. You'd love to see it. Love to see it. Free fire all over these fools. Do a little swing attack going. Yeah, I'm doing shit. Am out of stamina? A little bit of that. Put poison out. Not until I watch a Garfield movie. Fallout though in two days on Prime. Oh, okay, yeah, you're telling me that show launches, huh? Give this guy some poison. Oh, bro. Yo, that fool fucking smacked the shit out of me. I think I need better armor, bro. I think I need to get good. 309 max stamina. That's better. Take that. Take some max stamina. We got another, another big boy back here. Let's say, man, we should wait for our tank. We should wait for our tank. Poison him a bit, but. And I'm getting fighter guild experience. I actually needed fighter guild 
experience for a skill I need a lot. That works. Light it up. These big swings now. Oh shit. Get out of there. Hey. Come on. Switch the ability. I feel like the ability switching rate in this feels really slow. I'm not super loving that. I'll switch to my other uh other hot bar. I feel like there's always a delay that is longer than I would like for it to be. I'm also not getting any fucking stamina back. We'll put a fucking poison on him and a poison on him. That seemed to help. Seemed to help a little bit. That move does take a lot of my stamina, though. Maybe that's why. All right, we'll put another, uh, another bleed on him, or not bleed, but poison. That worked. I think that circle I put down too makes him weaker. But don't quote me on that. The whisper's secrets will be ours. Set it ablaze. Roll back. Roll back. I think I do something about how fast I'm losing Go, stamina. Turn it. I assume that's mainly just my uh, like equipment problem. Now. Okay, let's go. See how slow my stamina is coming back? I feel like it never used to be that slow. This is like a stamina build, so you think I would have less problem with stamina. So I must be doing something wrong. Let me call down my healer. Switch to this, call on my three. That should damage everybody there. Do something with this. And throw rocks at people. This sorcerer is sorcering better than ever before. Well my champion leveled up. That's a word, right? Smack some shit. Wanna put some poison damage on him? Where'd he go? Oh, I don't want to stand in that. The invisible? What the fuck? Oh, there he is. Oh! Can't yeah, put some poison on him. A little bit of poison on this bad boy right here. Sometimes I really like the combat in this game, and then other times it honestly feels super fucking boring. You I don't know what's amazing. going on. It was just the class I'm making. I'm feeling a little bit bored with the combat. I already have this. It's just like a slightly different role. It's not that exciting. It's not that exciting. Atavar, where are you? I don't like this. Where are you, Atavar? Atavar, wake Atavar, up. Atavar, speak to me. Wake up. Have to agree with the elf boss. Pour a drink out on him. There's some serious magic here. This uh, place pour out that drink for some respect ambush. on him, you know? Ambush. Ambush. Oh. A lovely idea. Oh, damn. I didn't even see people tied up over there. Oh, we got something about to go down. Still alive, are we? Come. I will make spigots of your throats. Okay, I guess we'll put a poison on him. Just to start with. Roll out of there. Roll out of there. I always hate when bosses just put puddles of shit next to them. It's so hard to manage as a DPS. I'll put another uh, venom on him. Whatever the number three is. Yeah, it just. That's, I have no idea what it does. I have no idea what it does. I'm gonna do a little bit of everything. Ooh, 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 hey, hey, chill, 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 chill. Here we gotta get another venom on him. There we go. Activity complete. Okay, we did the dungeon. This is the first time I ran that one. Got it. Got it, brother. 
Alright, what did, what did we actually get though, you know? What did we actually get? See, that increased health and magic and stamina recovery seems cool. But then I get rid of 285 of my maximum mana. I don't know about that one. This one might be better. Gives me more stamina. We'll equip this. Splunker's belt. Splunker's bracers. No. Sunderflame bracers. No. Anniversary Jubilee gift. Recipe. The ultimate river hold beef pasty. That sounds pretty good. I'm definitely going to have to level up my crafter a little bit. I'm going to have to get in there with my crafter. Where's the other thing I got? I got some gold. Where's that gold thing at? Okay, where you at? Oh, excuse me. Did I open two things? I don't think I opened two things. Am I just blind? I must open two things because I don't fucking see anything else. I thought I had one more chingadero to open. Is it in my mailbox? Is it in my mailbox? I'm daunted. Here we go. Soul gem, ancient scale, a shield I'll never use. And more of that stuff. More of this stuff down here. Which I think I use for crafting. Pretty sure I do. Pretty sure that's my crafting crap. My crafty crap. Alright, we got another one right there. How many of those can I run a day? I think I could run these like infinitely, huh? To get the undaunted exploration thing. Well, I, I would really want to run is this. Really want to run is that. I don't know how many of these blue things we get. Let's leave the group. Leave the instance. We'll go back to our little quest. Go back to our sweet little quest time. Sweet little questy time, you know? All right, so we have to travel to Blood Mean Mine, which was, I believe this is it. Where was it? Journal. The old journal. No, this is what we're doing. Go to Alinor's Royal Palace. Alinor! Okay, Alinor. Portal to the Arterium. Always think of that South Park episode. The planet Arium. You go all the way over there. You gotta go all the way over there. I should probably spend some of my champion points. I think, yeah, I got a lot of champion points to fuck with. I probably should be putting these into things. Increase your max stamina. That seems like a good idea. I'm just gonna do that. Yeah. I got a lot of points. Add to champion bar to activate. Okay. Do I have to add this to the champion bar? Or any of this? I'll increase my damage done, too. I think my big problem... The biggest problem I'm having... See, this gave me more stamina, too. The biggest problem I was having is just running out of stamina. I think I can, like, respect those, too, if that was, like, really dumb. But I don't think it was. I don't think it was. My Twitch broke me back. Welcome on back, man. Twitch be fucking trying to trick you, huh? I'm working on a little bit of my meta progression here, I guess. I really know what I want to put points into, though. Cost of repairing armor could be good. Cost of way shrine usage. Increase the goal gain by 2% per stage. I don't know. Remove one, removes 1,000 gold from your bounty once per day when committing a crime where a bounty is added. 
25 points a lot. That might actually save me some money in the long run. Increase the value of fence items. When you kill an enemy with a blade of woe, I don't use a blade of woe. Increase the chance to get higher quality loot. I don't pickpocket. That would be good for my crafter. Increase quality items you find in treasure chests. That might be good. Your weapon enchantment enchantments have a 10% chance not to consume a charge. I mean, movement speed is always good too, but to a point. Whenever you use a potion or poison, you have a 10% chance not to consume. This is all like the, yeah, this is like the crafting tree. Less fall damage could be good. I don't know. I don't really know what's like super useful here. Here's your mastery of mounts for moving all mount stamina costs. I don't think I've increased your mount speed. What do I gotta do to get to there? Ah, take a long line over there, huh? That might be the most useful for me. The mount speed might be the most useful. I mean, finding gold is good, too. Here's the amount of gold you find in treasure chests. I don't find that many treasure chests, though. Value of fence could be good, too, but I don't always go out of my way to do that. I say we work towards a horse. I don't know what else to really work towards. Okay, so we got that unlocked, right? 10% bonus. Your weapon enchantments have a 10% chance not to be consumed. A couple more points to unlock that. Okay, so we got one in that. Increase the quality of items you find in treasure chests. I mean, that one seems pretty good. Did I just put one point in here? Um, do I have to fully unlock this first to get over there? Probably. Okay. Well, we'll do that. Confirm. Confirms. Stealthy decree. The stealthiest of decrees. I don't think I have to drag and put those up there now. We got one more. Champion. We're now we're going to look at finesse. Fitness? Forgot what I was doing here. Reduce the cost of block. No. I don't really block that much. That's all. Nimble protector. Oh, I forget they go down in these. Uh, dead chat. Give me something to talk about, Slog. Um, uh, I don't know, man. What? What is your least favorite holiday? What holiday do you think just sucks nuts, bro? When you successfully block an attack, you have a 50% chance. I'm not going to do a lot of blocking. Which is the shit? Damn, I always exit out of here. What is the shittiest holiday you can think of? While under the effect of crowd control immunity, increase amount of damage you block by 2%. Okay, I'm in the wrong side because I'm not blocking. I'm not doing blocking stuff. Max health could be good. Probably Thanksgiving. I figured that's what a lot of people were going to say. I kind of like Thanksgiving though. I like getting around with the family and eating. But I could definitely see why that would be like people's choices for sure. I think I want to go with this. You want to go with rejuvenation. How do I get to said rejuvenation? Can I just click it? I can. Yeah, I like me some, uh, like me. Oh my God. That sneeze almost came out so loud and I just swallowed it. I just sucked that sneeze back into my body, bro. Oh my God. That was gnarly. Food always good, great, but not good with a lot of my family anymore. Oh, yeah. I feel like that's the big divisive thing. It's like if your family is kind of rough, then that's going to suck. I don't even like turkey. I don't even really like turkey, but I do like ham. And I do like all the sides. Sides are my favorite part. I don't celebrate holidays anymore. Just another day for me. You sound like my brother-in-law, dude. My brother-in-law is the same exact way. My brother-in-law be the same exact way, dude. Which is fine. You gotta do you. You gotta do you. Whatever you want to do, you know? Oh, he's kind of bittersweet. Yeah. 
Well, what's your favorite Thanksgiving side then, dude? Mine's mashed potatoes and gravy. Or mac and cheese. Or biscuits. Or, uh, green bean casserole. I could do without the yams. I'm not crazy about the yams, bro. Not too crazy about the old yams. What's this dickhead have to say? We gotta pick up all these quests. I wanna get all the Somerset quests done. Too many, ah, yeah, way too many options. Oh, there you are. The Relic Master has been looking all over for you. Oh, he has, has it? The Relic Master is looking for me? Why? You know, I didn't think to ask. Maybe it has to do with the missing relics. Yes, that sounds about right. Prime Rib does sound bomb, bro. Prime Rib sound bomb. I think turkey is the worst. Okay, so I think thin cut turkey on like a turkey sandwich is pretty good. But I think like actual, like a, cooking a whole fucking turkey, it always comes out dry. It's, I've never had turkey where I'm like, oh my God, I'm so glad I had turkey right now. You need some improvement? Just don't have the technology? You got to rebuild it, make it stronger, do some investments. Well, yes, but the Relic Master didn't seem too upset by the whole ordeal. He probably already saw how we were going to get them back. Maybe you have something to do with that? Just go ahead into the college ruins over there. You can't miss him. Ooh, the old college ruins. All right, I'll speak to the Relic Master. I'll speak to the old Relic Master. Where are we going? Are we going to get sidetracked? Follow through with this main quest, and then we'll go talk to the old, the old relic master. You must not have had deep fried turkey before. I have had deep fried turkey before. And I still thought it was kind of shit. My like hunter uncle, who goes and like shoots turkeys with bows and arrows in Arizona. Like I just don't think turkey is a good meat, bro. I don't think it's a good meat. Yeah, I so. I don't know what kind of fucking oil he used. But I'd say whether the turkey's dry or not, let me let me preface this. I don't think turkey is a good tasting meat. I think it's good if it's sliced very thin and it's on a sandwich. But besides that, nope. You disagree with the statement? That turkey's a bad meat? Or that dark is the best. Oh you white meat all week? Yeah, I'm not a big dark meat guy. I think turkey is just kind of kind of bullshit. I have a bullshit meat. Just give me some like little like chicken. I'd rather eat fucking chicken any day of the week. Breast is where it gets dry. Yeah, and that normally is the piece that I eat. I eat the breast and like the legs, or whatever the fuck it's called. Gotta inject it. I'd be injecting it, bro. Once it's done being cooked, you know, and everybody else left. I'd be injecting it. Let's get back on my mount here. I like five different areas. Damn. Yeah, you'd rather stick to prime rim? Yeah. It's like, I, we get, we always get turkey, but we also order ham. Because like, fucking ham is good all the time. Ham is always a good choice. Ham is always a delectable choice. Honey baked ham. And he, oh, I killed this guy earlier. Let's get him again. We'll make a tradition out of it. We'll make a tradition out of it. Portal to Somerset. Okay, we're going back to Somerset. Chicken is always my go-to no matter the occasion. Yeah, chicken's a good just like fallback meat. Can't think of a Christmas where we haven't had at least had, at least had a fried chicken. That's smart. I go, oh, we gotta all, go all the way back here. Okay, let's go get this waypoint, way portal. I can't, can't mount in this location. Fuck you, imp. You fucked up my jump, bro. You fucking crippled my jump, dog. Where is this thing? Okay, over this. I'm just gonna run. My work is pretty quick. Got pretty strong legs on old Orky boy right here, let me tell you. Yeah, but my favorite part of like even Christmas, it's always the sides, dude. I'm a size guy. I love the sides. I 
love me my good size. Especially mac and cheese, too. Mac and cheese can go with any holiday. Let's sell some shit real quick. I get them. Watergate salad? What is Watergate salad? What is this that you are referring to? I'm unaware of this referral. Reference? Reference. That's the word I was looking for. I'm just gonna keep selling all this shit, dude, because my fucking crafter is so backed up. Backed up more than a poop. I can finally sell this shit. Backed up like a constipated constipator. I can't really need this anymore. Are these the boots I'm wearing? I don't think these are the boots I'm wearing. No, they're not. Meow, oh, we still got kitty in here. Hello, kitty kitty. Hello, kitty kitty. Marshmallow salad? Oh, okay. Whenever I think of marshmallows, I just think with the yams. Kitty understands the tasty rat? 100%. Yeah, yeah. Cat loves a good rat. Cat loves a good rat. I can repair my shit too. I might as well repair this my shit. Seem... Here. All right, let's spend a little money. All right, I've only made five thousand dollars today. Not made that much money. Let me pick up another quest too. I don't want to miss any quests. A thousand pardons, but the battle reeve requires your prompt appearance at the proxy queen's court. Oh, does she know? <clears throat> Battle Reeve Tanalina requests your presence at the Royal Palace. There is a situation developing, and you have come highly recommended. Or so we have been led to believe. Eats a bird. Facts. Yams are goaded. If I eat more than a few, my stomach taps out too quickly from the sweetness. Yeah. Same for last always, but then they're cold. That's the problem, isn't it? Oh, you like the leftover yams? I'm not a big fan of them leftover. I always take a little bit. Like, I'll take like that much when I'm all done, right? Like at the end of the meal. Okay, Squire by Nor, what are you referring to? There are eager ears everywhere, so keep your voice low. The situation involves sea slowed. The battle reeve has oh, been informed that you dispatched one of the fell creatures. I find that implausible, but as a lowly squire, my opinion doesn't matter. How can I help? I can tell you that the Battle Reeve sent three adventurers and a squad of marines to determine the extent of the problem. After an initial report, contact with the group was lost. What the Battle Reeve will ask of you, well, that's for her to impart. Okay. You'll take them all? Me and my mom usually split the stuffing throughout the week. Yeah, the stuffing's good for a long time, bro. And like, I'll eat the leftover turkey. Like, we always take the leftover turkey home because we're the only, uh, in our, like, family unit, we're the only one with kids, right? Like, no one, none of the other siblings had kids, nothing. So we get all the leftovers. And I'll eat turkey sandwiches from dry turkey. It's just not my favorite. This is my favorite. Ain't my favorite. I'll talk to Battle Reeve 10 only in. Yeah, these NPCs, you know, their mouths... Stay really close together when they're talking. You can't even see that they're talking. You just can't even see it, you know? They're like ventriloquists. They're ventriloquist dolls. That's what's going on here. Just a bunch of ventriloquists. Guild Trader. I forget what the Guild Trader does. Do I sell shit to the Guild Trader? Every adventure. I bet I could buy shit from here. What guild am I on, though? I gotta switch guilds. Facts. Hard, cold facts. The high elves aren't so bad. Let's keep going with our speed. This shit takes forever, dude. Everything in this game takes forever. It is an MMO, though. I know that's what I need to come to expect. Screw the queue. They're all flailing. Rusty old dragons. Oh, these are all different guild names. Okay. I was a little bit confused. Oh, I was a little bit confused there. I got my quest mix up now. No, I think we're still going the right place. The sea loads. 
I got some sea loads for you. I got some sea loads for you. Oh, I didn't want pantalones. Pantaloons? Pantalones? Oh, we were right here. We were right here, silly me. Uh, no, we weren't. We were almost right there. We were so good. How the fuck do I get there? Do I gotta go all the way up these stairs? Are you kidding me? I gotta go all the way around here? You fucking game. At least I get a chance to ride my big old bear. Get my big old bear out for a spin, you know? Slowly get on up there. Stare at my big old orc ass. I can't quite hit that pitch. I can't quite hit the uwu pitch. But know that I'm I tried for you. I tried to uwu it, you know? I tried to give it the old college uwu. And they really made us go out of our way here. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate, my guys. There it is. There it is. Yeah, I'm not cute enough for that sound. I tried. All right, guys, I think I'm going to call it here because I have to wake up in a couple hours to go to a doctor's appointment. But I will not be working tomorrow. So hopefully I can get on a little bit earlier. Not sure if we're going to play more Elder Scrolls Online or not. Or if we're going to jump into something else. Um... I'm enjoying Elder Scrolls Online, but I just, I, I kind of feel like playing something else tomorrow. I wanted to play Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday Elder Scrolls Online, but I don't know, you know, I don't know. They, uh, dev, a dev reached out to me through email and wanted me to cover this. Let me just show you guys the game. Maybe you guys will be interested in this. They emailed me and asked me to check this game out. So I was... Thinking about checking it out. Um, application capture. What was that? Well, that was application audio capture. Wrong thing. Hold on. Hold on. It's a rhythm based roguelite or something like that. A rhythm based roguelite. Okay, so that's that one. Look at Steam. How do I get this to choose the right one? So blind. Now here's what we're gonna do. Add this. Display capture. No, nope, that's not what I wanted. Wrong screen. Display capture. There we go. Okay. Then, you gotta bear with me. I'm like adding things into OBS as I'm going. There we go. Okay. Now I just need to push this one around. Hey, there we go. Okay. I'm just not cool enough. I wish devs talked to me. Well, I just cover a lot of, um, I cover a lot of like playtest games, right? And a lot of games that like haven't gotten a lot of attention yet. So this is the game they want me to check out. It's called Remix. They don't offer to pay me. They didn't offer to pay me, but they gave me a game key and they also have a demo out for it right now. Let's check it out. I think this sound should be coming through. Hold on. Might just be a short. No, the sound's not coming through, but you get the idea. Then they got... So it's a remix is a unique, unique musical rhythm action game that combines the elements of rogue games. In this world, you are able to choose from a variety of heroes with different fighting styles and use power of music to battle against evil void monsters. It looks kind of interesting. You associate with the word rhythm as a recipe for disaster. That's literally what I told the devs, dude. 
I literally, I told the devs that. Elder Scrolls would have been crazy. Oh, yeah, no, not Elder Scrolls. No. No way, bro. Um, no, this is from Gamesmith. Not gonna lie, I'll take the key if you don't want it. No, I'm gonna fucking use it, bro. I ain't fucking giving it up. Um, but yeah, I told him, I was like, I'm no good at rhythm games. And he was like, well, I think, it, he's like, I've seen some of your videos. I think you'll be able to handle it. And it's not like purely rhythm based, right? So like, we're definitely gonna check it out. But you can download the, you can download the demo right now, God. You can go download the demo and check it out for yourself. It looks interesting. I'm terrible at rhythm games though. You're not wrong there, bro. So maybe we'll check that out tomorrow. I was going to save that for Thursday though, because Thursday was supposed to be like my indie, you know, play test days, my like that. And Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday were going to be my Elder Scrolls day. So I don't know. We'll have to see how I'm feeling tomorrow about it. You're just trying to save me? Well, I don't mind playing games that I don't like, may maybe not like totally love. You know, I'm fine with that. Let's get a raid in on somebody before I jump off for the night. Let's spread the Twitch love. Let's spread our love all over somebody. How come Cedra isn't fucking peed out of here never on when I am? Find someone else doing Elder Scrolls or something. Those fools are never on when I'm on, bro. And they're never fucking on, dog. They go to bed early, huh? They go to bed super duper early. That's bad, y'all. Okay, last time, one time I went into someone's server and they spoke Russian. So that didn't really help anybody very much. I want to raid somebody with like one viewer. Let's let's set up Smorzil. Let's up Smorzil. Smorliz. Smorliz? Let's, let's set up this cat. Let's give him a little bit of love. Give him a little bit of love out there, you know? There, more often than not, uh, you just stream later. Yeah, that's true. Smorlize. That's his name. Smorlize. Yeah, let's spread the love a little bit. I did raid wrong. I always type thing in wrong. More lies. All right, everybody. Well, thank you again for tuning in tonight. Let's go show this more lies guy a little bit of ESO love. And I will see you guys tomorrow night on the stream. Let's do it. Goodbye.